hello? Oh my god. <laughs> um, okay, that was not intended. <laughs> that was not intended. I don't know what happened. Um, it just like broke. But hello, everybody. <laughs> Uh, hold hold on oh oh gosh there we go okay the villager bracket i'm so confused me too i apologize but it's all it's all good now we're all fine um hello everybody i appreciate you being here um you totally fixed yeah no 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 i knew actually that marty was like a you know an amiibo only one so it was i just kind of wanted it to be suspenseful for maple you know yeah i'm so confused that bracket makes no sense you know what i just got home from a very long road trip and this is the best that i could do but anyway am i the only one who's blurry i think it's i think it's okay but so basically I, the, okay key things is i went through every single villager and i found like the ones that i thought would fit quinoa best the ones whose whose vibes vibed with me and then i just kind of i got I, I made a little bracket but basically i did it based on like their their like rankings there's like a website online that ranks animal crossing villagers and it has like the most popular ones every single month or something like that so I did like a literal like like seeds and then ranked them in the way that they would be. So it is fair, even though it doesn't look fair. I did it very fairly and objectively. And yeah, I'm pretty I'm excited. I'm excited. I think this is going to be super, super fun. So, OK, you're going to have to let me know if the music or the microphone or anything is bad because uh, yeah, <laughs> because I'm a mess. My like my I'm so sorry, but before we start, my fire alarms in this apartment building are just going off because of the humidity for some reason. Oh, okay, never mind. We're starting. We're starting. Okay. Okay, my bad. Okay. Let's start. Let's begin. Start a poll. Who wins? We're gonna begin with Melba and Billy. I will ask you. Okay, I have the poll up. And let me see. Oh, crud. I forgot. Okay, hold on, hold on. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. I'm going to set a minute timer and I'm going to tell you about these villagers while you vote. Okay. One minute timer. Going now. Okay. Melba is a koala. As you can see, her skill is shadow puppetry, which is not very typical, you know? So it's kind of cool. Also, born April 12th. What a, a good day. Her catchphrase is is toasty, which is kind of cool because I, like, I don't know, she's a koala and toast and Vegemite and all that stuff. And her greatest Halloween fear is the mummy mask, whatever that means. OK, moving on to Bill. Bill is a jock. He doesn't look like he'd be a jock, but he is. Uh, his catchphrase is Dag Nabbit, which is very, very cute. I love that. He is the eldest of two kids and <laughs> his skill is subsistence living, which like doesn't really seem, seem like a skill, but pop off, I guess. Um, yeah. Wow. Okay. That just threw me for, through a loop. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. And our minute, our minute is up. Get your goats, get, not your goats, get your votes in, get your votes and your goats in, and then we will proceed. And oh my gosh, poor, poor Billy, poor Billy. Okay, we will end the poll. So, Billy, Billy, you're, you're dead. You're dead to us now. Not actually dead. That would be concerning. Let me see, I, I prepared. Melba. Pro moves on. Proceeds. Okay. Let's see. Pull. Now we will go to Hugh and Kiki. I will ask you. And I'm going to say like they're... I'm going to say a little bit about them before I do the timer this time because I realize that makes more sense. That's totally my bad. But anyway. Hugh is a lazy villager. His catchphrase... Snortle and his he just likes to keep it chill 
keep it real. Real chill is like his little catchphrase type of thing. His main goal in life is to be a carpenter, which I think is just great. And his skill is eating quickly. As you can see in the picture, he has a donut. So love that for him. And yeah, or pretty much that's everything you need to know about Hugh. Now, Kiki. Kiki is a cat, as you can see. The mouth is a little bit weird. I thought Kiki was cuter until I saw the mouth up close, and then I was like, eh, but you know, I still love Kiki. And the catchphrase, nothing ventured, nothing gained. I love that. I love that. The, the second of five kids and prefers her coffee beans as mocha beans, which I thought that was all coffee beans, so that's my bad. And yeah, I feel like that's everything there is to know about lovely Kiki, so... I literally started the poll already. What did I say? What did I say? The second of five kids. I know. I know. Oh, guys. Did you just kill Hugh? Oh my gosh. That that hurts. Wow. Okay. Okay. End poll. Kiki won by a freaking landslide. Oh, we've got some tough competition. This is... Oh, I really liked Hugh. I really, really loved Hugh, but it's okay. Okay, we obliterated Hugh. You you definitely did. So yeah, I'm going to do the description before opening the poll this time because I literally forgot that I opened it. So that's totally my bad. Okay. Let us see. So now we're moving up to the top right quadr qua qua quadrant, not quandary. We've got Poncho. Poncho is a lovely little bear whose catchphrase, fortune favors the brave. I love that for him. He doesn't look like he would be, but he is actually a jock villager. And you thought that Kiki had a big family. Poncho is the second of six kids. Six kids, that's a lot of kids. Uh, his skill is making puns, which uh, I love that. I really do love that. Now let us see. Okay. Also, his Halloween fear is a werewolf hood, which is so interesting to me. Like, I totally get that for some reason. Okay, now facing off against the lovely Poncho is gonna be Hornsby, a lazy personality. We've got a lot of lady, like lazy personalities on our island already. We've got like Lucky, Sherb, I think Doc maybe too, but like he would fit in. Or is it too many? That's that's for you to decide. His catchphrase: "You can't hit a mosquito with a horseshoe." I literally think that that's incorrect, but I respect it anyway. The catchphrase, schnozzle. I think that's very cute. And his birthday is March 20th, which just happens to be the day after mine. So yours truly, maybe that's a little extra point. And his skill is bunting. I, I don't know what that means. Like bunting a baseball? That's like such an oddly specific skill to have, I feel. Like if somebody was like, oh, what's wh what are you best at? What's your skill? And you just said bunting. I feel like I would be really confused, but that's okay. Okay, the poll is opening. Okay. Cast your votes. Cast your votes. My birthday's March 19th too? Oh my gosh, Bailey. That's so exciting. Happy birthday to both of us and almost to Hornsby. <laughs> okay. I do not like Poncho. You know, I respect that. I respect that. Poncho is like kind of cute. I, I don't know. I just like got good vibes from Poncho. He just seemed a little cute and we don't have like a bear yet. So I just thought it made sense, but maybe it doesn't make sense. <laughs> Hornsby bullied Marina on my island. Oh my, look at him. He's just a silly little guy. He would never. Wow, I can't believe that, honestly. There's not enough jocks on your island. That's, this is true. We only have Bill, only one. I can't pass up on the name Hornsby. Salmons, you it's a fine taste you have. Hornsby is a very funny name and I like it. Oh goodness, oh goodness. Okay, the timer has gone off. And it's Hornsby. Oh my gosh, goodbye, dear Poncho. You were no match for the Hornsby, the horn man himself. I, <laughs> such a weird name. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So. All right, the last round. 
I originally had Marty here. I for I did not know he was an amiibo only character. I just thought he was kind of cute, but let me just, I gotta pull up Maple's page real quick. Okay. Maple. Maple is so sweet. Look at that face. Actually, maybe not that face. Maybe like go to Google and look up Maple and look at that face. But Maple is the eldest of four kids. Her skill is writing letters, which is great because I like receiving letters. That's very cute. And her goal is to be an architect one day, which is just adorable. Can't you see her just building your house? I feel like I can. Okay, and our final competitor that we have not yet talked about is Tad. Tad, this little frog, this cute little frog, his catchphrase is slurp. Love that. He's a third quintuplet. Like, we've got big families, but quintuplet. That, that is literally, that's fantastic. His goal in life, his only goal is to be a CEO. We don't know of what, but at the same time, I love the like ambition, you know? Just like having that goal at all is just respectable. And I think it's cool. And also, Tad is a jock. As we've said, we don't really have a lot of jock villagers, so it'd be good to just round out the roster for sure. And his favorite colors are yellow and colorful, which is not really a color, but you know, that's okay, Ted. That's okay. Okay, starting. Who will win? Will it be Maple? Please forgive that photo. That was the first thing that popped up. Or Tad, this adorable little frog. Colorful is not a color, vote Maple. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You can't vote against Tad just because he likes colorful. I mean, like, the colors of the rainbow are beautiful. You can't blame Tad, you know? This is so hard. I know. There's just so, so many good villagers. They never said they were going to be the CEO of art. This is, this is very true, yeah. <laughs> oh, gosh. This is, this is pretty close. Tad is going to die. Oh, my God. Oh my god, it's so close. Oh my gosh. Yeah, would it change your minds if we said that Tad was the CEO of, like, a company called Colorful or something? I don't know. Oh my gosh, this is- this is devastating. Oh goodness. It feels hateful putting Maple and Tad against each other. I mean, they probably would have ended up against each other anyway, you know? Oh gosh, oh gosh. I'll pay $10 for Maple to lose. I can't skew it. It's everybody's choice. Oh, this is, this is, this is devastating. I wanted Tad to win. Oh no, Tad's gonna die. Tad is LGBT, it's Pride. Oh my God, you wouldn't kill Tad, would you? Oh no, not in Pride Month. Oh no. <laughs> oh God. Uh... Oh, this is horrible. Oh no, three seconds left. Oh god. Okay, zero seconds and Tad loses. And it is a maple win. Um, unfortunately, I don't have a picture of Maple's face. So I'm just gonna do that <laughs> okay oh my gosh that's devastating i wasn't expecting that outcome honestly okay now let us see okay okay we're gonna end that poll that is wow wow that really shocked me i'm not even gonna lie i was doing my predictions before this i thought it was gonna be tad that won the whole thing but no 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 okay now we return to the left side of the bracket. Who wins between the sweet, sweet little koala Melba or the cat Kiki? Who, who is gonna be the winner? Oh, starting off hot. Oh my goodness. This is, this is like, I wasn't even expecting that at all. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm, I'm shocked, I'm baffled. Go Kiki, go Kiki. I think, like, I think any of these people could fit perfectly on Quinoa. So, like, it isn't even a consideration in my mind of, like, who fits better. Because I could see them all, like, getting along with the other villagers, just enjoying the island. It's just a matter of, like, 
who you think. You feel? This is going such an interesting direction, though, that I really was not anticipating. Oh, goodness. Okay. I literally forgot to start the timer. I was just looking at this picture of Maple and I was a little bit mesmerized. But we're gonna start. I assume it's been 30 seconds. Melba has more variety. I don't know what that means, but I, I, I assume that you might be right. There's like... Oh, I, I can already like imagine the builds that I would do for all these people. I'm just so excited to see who it is. It's so exciting. And this is like, Kiki was winning, now Melba's winning. Melba is like, oh. Oh. I feel like, I feel like Melba and Fauna would be best friends. Is that just me? Or like, Melba and Poppy like gardening together? Come on now. Chat loves Kiki, but the poll is different. Yeah, you need to put your votes into the poll, not the chat. I can't believe y'all are killing Kiki. I know they just killed Tad and now they're killing Kiki. Oh no, no, no. It's okay though. We're gonna be okay. And the timer should have gone off and it decided not to, but Melba is gonna be our winner. Oh goodness. Did I just, did I copy and paste? I did. Oh my gosh, we are almost there, friends. We are almost there. Oh gosh, it's okay. Kiki's dead, but it's just the way it is. It's just the way the cookie crumbles. That's the way it crumbled. You just gotta lick it up and let it go. Okay, who wins between Hornsby, who's a, apparently like kind of a bully, or Maple, who somehow, somehow killed Tad and got to the place she is now. If Hornsby doesn't win, I'm gonna cry. The poll is the is the vote. It's the deciding vote. Oh goodness, oh goodness. Not sure I've ever heard lick it up for that. Would you waste a perfectly good cookie, Salman? It's it's, it's logic. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh, this is gonna be a close one, I feel. Oh, Hornsby is coming up. Maple is in the lead firmly, but Hornsby is making a little bit of a comeback. It's my birthday. Hornsby has to win. Oh my gosh. Happy birthday, Andrea. Thank you for being here. I appreciate it. <laughs> oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. <laughs> Sorry, Hornsby. I like Maple better. Oh my gosh. It seems like a lot of people feel that way. Oh, this is... This is... Oh, gosh. This was the hardest choice I've ever made. I mean, I'm scared. I literally, I thought that Tad was going to win all of this. Like, look at him. He's so precious. I don't even know who's going to win. <laughs> this is, this is ridiculous. Did you not realize Maple's one of the most popular villagers? I mean, I thought like, yeah, but like, I mean, I loved Maple, but I didn't think it would go this way. Oh my gosh. And it, it is settled. Maple kills Tad. Nope. Who did Maple kill? Horns B. Oh my god. She's at it again. Oh no. Okay. I'm putting back the KK Rider. Okay. KK, take us home. Sorry, I have to find this cursed little Maple thing. I did not plan for this. Okay. The final two competitors it's gonna be melba or it's gonna be maple two m's two sweethearts two little little darling bears i don't, I don't really know okay this is this is uh, like i was not expecting this outcome but I'm, I'm okay there you go and i you know what i'm gonna do a two minute timer i think that we we need time to think you know we can revisit their profiles. What is Melba all about? Melba is adorable. She Her favorite saying is a friend who shares is a friend who cares. Freaking adorable. Love that. Let's see. A normal villager. We do have some normal villagers. Like I said, I feel like she'd get along with Poppy. She'd get along with Fauna. They just would. Also, her favorite color is colorful. So that's good too. Oh my goodness. And in her coffee, she does not like milk or sugar. That's kind of raw, you know? 
Like, I, I, I mean, come on now. That's kind of amazing. Now, maple. Let us revisit. Okay. Her catchphrase is honey, which is really, really cute because she's a bear and bears eat honey and, you know, it's all that. All that worked just for Melba to sweep. I know. Oh my gosh. She is just adorable, is she not? Waste not, want not. I totally agree. Her birthday is June 15th. Great day to have a birthday. I don't know anybody whose birthday is on that day, but I, I love that day. I think it's great. Let's see. She likes to wear... Ooh, a dapper tee. A little dapper bear. I love that for you. And then also, she likes a little petal parasol. She, her least favorite style is flashy. She's very humble. She likes a basic style. She likes to just blend in. And like we said, women in STEM, she is aspiring to be an architect, which is freaking amazing. And I could use the help, frankly, because, you know, if we're going to be building all these buildings, doing all these builds, like, I don't know. I don't know. Oh my gosh, Melba's winning? No way! Oh my god! That is so... I did not expect that. They're both amazing, but I think Melba... Yeah, there's no losing here. But oh my gosh, three, two, one. It is Melba. It is Melba! I don't know why I wasn't expecting that, but oh my gosh. Wait... Melba wins! Oh, crud. Melba wins! Melba wins the whole thing! A hand. A hand for Melba. Oh my gosh. That is incredible. You know what's crazy about that? Is that Melba is literally the person in the thumbnail. Like, I just did a random villager to, like, have a shadow and be like, ooh, who is that? It's literally Melba! Oh my gosh, I'm actually so excited. It's like full circle too, because we have Faith and now we'll have Melba. I'm like, <gasps> no way. But thank you guys so much for being here. Thank you for voting. Oh my gosh, I just super chat, it, it, it zipped away. I don't even know, hello? Where'd it go? And Mac the Cat said, thank you so much. Thanks for a fun Saturday afternoon. This is exactly the Charlie brand of chaos I expect. This is definitely chaotic, but also, I don't know. I wouldn't have wanted it any other way. Thank you so much. Now. Ahem. Music off. Okay. Now. Okay. Okay. I got a lot, you know. Oh, Maple wasn't in the folder. Neither was. Okay. <laughs> Shh. Go away. Okay. And now it comes time to find Melba. Oh my god, that rain, jeez. Also, I didn't rig it. I honestly thought Tad was gonna win, so I'm actually quite shocked right now. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you. But, okay, this is the plot that our dearest Tammy P. Bear left just this morning. And I was super, super excited. I think it's gonna be a good villager hunt today. And guess what, everybody? I have... A Nook Mile counter. Look at that in the top left corner. Wow, who is she? She's so prepared. It's me. It's Charlie. I'm here. I'm ready. And look at this. Like a bajillion Nook Mile tickets. This is going to be a good day. This is going to be a good day. All right. Oops. I stomped on my hybrids. Let us begin. I also... Look at how prepared I am. I brought a wardrobe for when we inevitably change outfit because, I don't know, we always do that for some reason, but I'm like so prepared. And Cindy, thank you so much for getting a membership. Thank, welcome to Sprigdom. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate the support. But okay. Melba. Melba is the is the one that we're looking for. I am I'm nervous. I feel like every other villager we like a villager hunt that we've done, we ended up getting the villager within like exactly three hours, like exactly a stream's length. So I'm gonna be very devastated if this goes on for like 20 years but it's okay for melba i'd do anything you know would you ever play undertale i have played undertale i have one video of it on my channel already of like my first playthrough ever and i'm actually making an undertale video right now with the lovely shawnee do so yeah, it's coming imagine we find her first island i would oh I would cry, you know? I think that every time and it never happens and, and maybe this is the time? Maybe this is the one?
Oh, oh no, 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 that was not the one. Oh, for a second, I, was, I really, it had me going. I was like, oh yeah, mm-hmm. Oh, oh, oh yeah. But it's okay, because we are ready. We're in it for the long haul. We have like 150 Nook Mile tickets or something. Uh, Because like I said, I'm like literally a thief and a time traveler and a rascal now. She accidentally did a genocide run. Yeah, I literally didn't know that that was a thing. I didn't know there were different like runs or anything like that. So that was really fun. And everyone was like, no way you did that. I'm like, sorry, I just listened to instructions. Sorry, I respected Toriel. My bad. I literally in the first grade, they there was this project. And for some reason, we had to like cut straws and they had to be exactly an inch length. Every single straw needed to be exactly an inch. And the teacher was actually so mad because nobody could do it except me like the entire class nobody did that nobody cut it to exactly an inch they just did whatever they wanted to but i did oh i did also i, I gotta change it to two okay second island so what happens if you find maple then you know what too bad because we already chose we chose melba i mean you, the, the, I respect your decision. As much as I hate that you killed Tad, especially during Pride Month, now we gotta go for it. We gotta find Melba. That is not Melba at all. I don't even know who that is. But I'm going to check. Do we have a little, a little bottle? No, we do not. Maybe on this side? I am also getting like, ooh, that's kind of a cute villager though. I'm getting the intense urge to just like start a new island. <laughs> And I, I, I just might do it, but like not at the same, not at the same time. Like I wouldn't destroy quinoa for a new island, but I'm just like, ooh, it would be fun to do like a little, a little challenge or something. I don't know. I want to so bad. Oh goodness, Agnes, that's Agnes. Oh, goodbye, Agnes. Thank you for gracing us with your presence. But yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm getting the, the urge. Okay. Three. I'm going to do this manually because I'm sure there's plugins for it, but I did not find them in time. <laughs> it's okay, though. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. Let's use our third Nook Mile ticket. That clean slate feeling. I feel it. I restarted my island last week. I know. I just like forget what the beginning of the game is like. I just kind of want to. And I watched like Froggy Crossing's 30 day challenge thing where she posted like a video every day and did like a certain challenge on the island kind of like oh you can only like you can't buy things from nookazon or something like that and i was like oh my gosh that looks so fun like i want to do like a, a challenge like that i think that would be so cool but first i must complete quinoa or i must buy another nintendo switch so there's that oh my god no 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 I do not like I think that that I think it's like Angus or something that little guy was uh one of my starter villagers on my very first New Horizons Island and I did not like him I did not like him very much but it's okay it's okay it's guy fiery it is not it's not guy fiery apparently guy fiery is actually just like a really lovely person and I, for some reason i didn't expect it but i feel bad that i didn't you know i'm kind of like that that tracks so i'm kind of a guy fiery stan i won't lie okay oh my god i'm, I'm gaming i'm changing this and i'm clicking the a button look at me go okay just buy a second switch i definitely want to i just have to like, I'm moving again. I know, I know. But I did find a place, so I'm moving. Hopefully for the final time, at least for the next couple of years. Uh, this month, I think? At, 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 like, the next month? I don't know. Some, something. Sometime soon. So after I do that, I'm definitely going to get another Switch and start a new island. And Melba is going to be there? Oh, it's it's Meringue! It's like the, the hippo that's also a food. I think a lot of people like her. I also... I was so shocked to see that Marty was number one on the villager list this month. Like, what? Why, why does everybody like Marty? Marty stands. Elaborate, please. That's a rhino? Oh, crud. My bad. 
They look kind of the same to me. But yes, but yes. Why do people like Marty so much? I feel like Marty is... Like, interesting. He's got kind of one of those specialty villagers that's just a little... A little spicy. But I'd never even seen him before. Ever. Until I was looking at the tier list this morning. Okay. All right, all right. This is the one. I feel it. I'm also this. My apartment is so hot right now. I don't know why. Like all the fire alarms were going off, and then I took my fan out so that it wouldn't like make a lot of noise. And now I'm dying. <laughs> Mark my words. 29th ticket. Okay, not sneaky. I'm marking him. I'm marking him. We're gonna see if it's the 29th ticket. Right now we are on ticket five. Meringue's birthday is March 19th? Oh my gosh! Birthday buddies! That's actually so... Uh, well, now I feel bad. I should have at least said hello. Ain't no way anyone likes Marty. Marty is literally the number one villager of all of them right now. So somebody likes him. Oh, I've never seen that eagle before. I feel like I should say hello. I've been a little rude. Hello. When? Ooh. I've never met... I've never met you before. I really like your little hair thing, though. It, it, your, like, pink streak. It looks dope. I want to do, like, a video where I have to guess the villagers' names. Like, I need to see if I know the name of every villager. Because I feel like I do. You know? I've never seen Quinn before. So adorable. I haven't either. I actually kind of like Quinn. But I also just feel like, you know... She doesn't fit the vibe of the island. Like, quinoa is very specific. And also, we're going for Melba, so. Oh, I share the same birthday with Wolfgang. That is such a good villager to share a birthday with. I just love Wolfgang. I feel like he's my, like, Animal Crossing granddad. Okay. Okay. And so it begins. I'm really hoping that this doesn't take, like, a bajillion years, but we'll find out. Like, I think it would be kind of cruel if Nintendo decided that my last villager that I was going to go and hunt for was going to be the worst. I would take that a little personally, honestly. I would eat that video up. I think it would be so fun. And also it would be like a proof of concept. Like, do I know things? Do I know Animal Crossing things? Which I think I kind of do. Lobo is my birthday twin. Oh, that's so cute. I really like... I feel like that's so cute. Finding a villager that you share birthdays with. Like, I just love that. I kind of wish that mine was a villager I liked. Not that I don't like Meringue, but it's like, you know. <gasps> it is what it is. Okay. What's the worst villager that's not Al? Uh, um, I'm, I'm gonna be honest here and say what I'm thinking. It's got to be Monique, right? Like, if you don't know Monique, it's probably good that you don't know Monique. But I don't know. Monique was on my first Wild World Island and she literally bullied the living daylights out of me. She bullied the boj bojangles out of me. And she just, I don't, her character design is not the most pleasing, we'll say. Like, I love her in a weird, twisted way, but she's probably the second worst. <laughs> Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Why does everyone get Al as a starter? Is that a thing? I don't know. Like, they could have at least chosen a good one, I feel. I don't know. I, you know, the thing, too, is, like, I'll say something about, like... I don't, I don't know, like Flora or, or something. I'll be like, I don't like Flora. And then people will be like, oh my gosh, how could you say that about Flora? But I say that about Al and literally nobody is like, like defending him at all. They're just like, mm, yeah. <gasps> Stop, it's Kabuki. I almost put you on the tier list. I love you. My car is named after you. Oh gosh. Oh, that's so sad. I was literally going to put Kabuki onto the tier list and then I just didn't because I just, it just felt like he didn't fit the vibes of Quinoa. I'm like, we have one grumpy grandpa already. We don't need two, do we? I don't know. Okay, goodbye, dearest Kabuki. We're getting some good villagers though, I th which is making me feel good. Who are you looking for? We're looking for Melba. 
Oh, I could probably like change the... I'm going to change the title. Melba. There we go. There we go. My girlfriend shares a birthday with Ketchup and Eric. Those are like two extremely solid villagers to share a birthday with. I will not lie. Like, I really like Ketchup and I like Eric too. Little cutie patootie. Okay. I feel so organized right now. Look at this. I had a counter ready. I literally made a whole bracket. I feel like usually I just roll up to the stream and I'm like, hey, hello. Hi. <laughs> um, today? Oh, no, no. Why does Melba remind me of Taco Bell? I don't... I really don't know. Maybe I can make Melba a Taco Bell. Oh, <gasps> that'd be kind of cool. <laughs> And Steph says, hi, thank you so much for joining and for getting membership. I hope you have a great time at work the rest of your shift. Thank you. Oh my gosh, I'm trying to think like Melba. I don't know what I would do for her. <sighs> no, why was that? Is that like a parrot? Like that's not an eagle, right? It's like it's neon. Oh my gosh, I, I must I must depart. It looks like one of those, like, budgie things. My brother has a budgie. And it, it just kind of looks like that. I don't know why. <laughs> it's just a silly bird. Just a silly little guy. Melba seems like the type to have a cozy library theme. I, yeah. It's just that I... I already did that for Fauna. Fauna has the library on the island. So I'm thinking that Melba would need to do, like... Uh, I don't know. I, for like when I was looking at maple, I was thinking like, oh, we could do like a cute little honey stand, like a little farmer's market honey type of thing or like a little honey farm. But Melba, Melba is, hmm, Melba could have a beach house. That's true. I don't know. I don't know anything about Melba, really. Oh, my goodness. What is what what is Australia? What do, what do Australian koalas do? I feel like they just like eat and like fall off trees. I don't know. I assume Melba does more than that, but <laughs> we'll have to look. We'll have to look. Please, please, who's hiding? Is that Fang or something? Oh, it's a chicken. Is this Egbert? It's Goose. Goose the chicken. I don't even come out of hiding. Ew. <laughs> I do not like that guy. I feel like that looks like every chicken that's like the face of a fast food restaurant. Any chicken fast food restaurant. It, it looks exactly like that, you know? Melba sh could have a garden. That's true, but already Poppy has a garden. Let's look up facts about koalas. Oh, they're kind of cute. When they're, like, rubbing their eyes. Okay. Let me let me get to the next island, and then we'll start our research. Um, I would like to fly. It would be so easy if there was just a button that was like, go to the next island, instead of having to go through all of this malarkey. But it's okay. I'm over it. I'm over it. I'm ready. Okay. Top 10 facts about koalas. Oh my gosh. Okay. Koala means no drink. What? Do they not? They don't drink water? Oh my gosh. That's... Okay. They eat... Oh, they eat like... Well, we can't do another kind of like... They have eucalyptus leaves as like their main thing, but I can't... We already did kind of like a garden type of deal. Melba's bar. That is literally the opposite. <laughs> you took the opposite away from that. Why would she run a bar if she herself cannot drink? Actually, that would be kind of funny. Oh, it's a... Uh, Her eyes kind of scare me. It's like they're sewn shut. It reminds me of Coraline, and I, I don't like it. Because that movie was a wee bit freaky. We could have like a like a drink stand, like a juice, a lemonade stand for Melba or something. I mean, there's no lemons in Animal Crossing, so a peach orchard would be cute. Yeah, we don't have like an orchard. We could do an orchard. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And then let's see. Let's see. They live in one of the 
driest continents in the world. Okay, thank you for that. Um, They share... Okay, this is not the kind of facts that I want. I want, like, facts about the behavior of a koala. Like, if a koala was going to open an establishment, what kind would it be? Specifically is what I'm looking for. So get it right, Google, please. Okay, let's see. Hmm. Let's see. Let's see. Um. What do koalas like to do for fun? Let us dive in. Uh, they spend their time dozing. That's true. Koalas can sleep up to 18 hours a day. Should we make like a... <laughs> we can make we can make like a, a little hostel or something i don't know the, the, it seems like literally all that koalas do is sleep and then like eat a bunch of food and then sleep some more and like never drink and sleep oh it's this guy hello spork oh my god i knew you had a funny name spork i was looking through the the pigs and it made me laugh so hard that his name was just spork like, I feel like that's so unfortunate. Like, being named... Uh, spoon. Like, I just feel like that they, there's better words to be your name. Hmm. Hmm. A bed and breakfast? Oh, wait! A bed and breakfast is so cute! Oh, wait! A bed and breakfast! Oh, that would be so precious! I'm kind of a ta mattress store. Okay, Penne. <laughs> Hi, my name's Bread Knife. Exactly! Like, why? Especially Spork. I feel like that's just like... I don't know. Sporks feel weird to me. They make me feel weird. Is that just me? I don't like... Bleh. They like give me the shivers. Like, I don't like Sporks. I really... Nobody asked for that, I feel. I, okay, I'm kind of attached to a bed and breakfast. I'm just gonna say it. I think we should do, like, a bed and breakfast, because then it's cute because she eats a lot, she sleeps a lot, and it's a bed and breakfast, so she can sleep and eat. It, it literally maps perfectly. I used to go buy Spoon online. Why? You had so many choices. Sporks don't even work. I know, like, the, the prongs aren't long enough. And then, and then the, they're intruding on the spoon. <gasps> Guys, it's Scoot. Oh. Oh, I love Scoot so much. Oh. Oh my gosh. You know, I took Bill instead of you, but I, w I wish I love you. I, I love Scoot. Oh, Scoot was my favorite on my my first island. I'm, I'm heartbroken. But it's good that we got to see him, you know? At least I got to say hello got replaced by bill in yeah i know devastating ah oh, so sad because it's funny charlie come on I'm, I'm my bad my bad i just feel like if i could name myself anything to go by online i'd rather be called like like super super cool it's, uh i don't know something something that said my status to all like i don't know like you hear spoon and you're like oh ha but i want it to be like expert animal crossing player number one you know and then people would be like oh hello there goodness unhindered clown exactly unhindered clown says everything it needs to say unhindered clown says eat your vegas and nothing else oh goodness <laughs> why are so many people here nicknamed spoon okay i take it back i'm so sorry i feel like i feel like spoon is a better nickname than spork you know like maybe i don't get the charm but if i met someone named spoon i'd probably love that about them also that is a really cute eagle but i i i cannot oh goodness and jennifer thank you so much for the super chat i really appreciate it a ba oh, sorry. A bakery or a bed and breakfast would be good for Melba because you can make the pun of having Melba toast. Mm -hmm. I agree. I agree. I'm into the bed and breakfast idea, honestly. Like, 
I, I think that is 100% what we're going for. And all of you lovely stream folks get to know before anybody else. And everybody else, it's a secret to them. You know? Melba Toast is what she's named after? I literally didn't know that existed. That makes so much sense now. <laughs> okay, let, let us see. And Poppy565, thank you so much for the super chat as well. I really, really appreciate it. My contribution to your second Switch fund, thank you. I know, I've got to... I've got to get a second Switch. I've got to start a new island. I just feel it inside me. It's like time, you know? But yeah. Oh, goodness. Use the ranch furniture for the B&B? &B? Okay, I'll have to write that down. I feel like that's a... That sounds like it'd fit. But do you have an island theme? I kind of like... I don't know. There's no like conclusive thing holding the island together except my presence on it. Um, no, I... I hate the gorilla. I hate the gorillas more than any other thing in this game. Why are they here? But yeah, just kind of the theme is like Charlie Town, you know? The theme is good vibes, good times. It's kind of like... It's literally my first island that I've ever done that I've like decorated and tried and like made it into a little town kind of thing. Usually I just play and don't really think about that stuff, but I don't know. I think that it's... That's the theme. It's just kind of like my first time being able to decorate things just how I would want them to be and like doing what feels right. And then probably the next island I do or the stuff I do in the future is going to be like more themed stuff and like have more of a central thesis rather than just whatever <laughs> i want it to be but i don't know the series is kind of like you know my first time playing animal crossing and then at the same time i want to like have the first time experience like i don't want to give myself too many too many parameters you feel but yeah and graceman thank you so much for the super chat australia equals vegemite equals melba that math seems like it's mathing, I must say. How does Vegemite connect to Melba? Because apparently Melba is a type of toast. And Vegemite goes on toast? What is... Who are you? What? Oh my god! Oh my. Oh, it's the Karen hamster. Oh, I don't. I don't. I don't. I, d I don't. No, thanks. I didn't, I didn't enjoy that at all. Okay. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. I was like, I do, I'm still processing that hamster. She looks like a Karen. She does. She does. <laughs> I also think I, I, I know that this is probably just me getting into like Nook Mile hunting mode where it's like my outfit doesn't matter. But I also think that now that we know the villager is Melba, we should change our outfit and do, you know, Something a little bit more Australian. Uh, good, good eye. I'm so sorry. I've like never heard an Australian accent in my life. I apologize. Okay. Charlie, do you have a P.O. box? I'll send you a switch. Oh my gosh. That's, you, are, you are too kind. You do not have to do that. I don't have a P.O. box right now. But I am going to make one within like the next month. Like as soon as I finish my next move and kind of like get situated i'm gonna find a place to do a p.o box for certain but oh my gosh you did not have to do that thank you thank you so much though <laughs> steve Irwin. oh my gosh i have i've heard steve Irwin talk the sweet tones of steve Irwin, but it's been a while i don't remember all i know is i need this except wait oh that matches wait but now my shorts don't match what the heck the nut do i not have oh oh no 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 <laughs> oh it's fine it's just gonna bother me to no end but it'll be okay all right and then we just gotta get some little australian shoes or i'm just gonna do my classic like white sneakers look at us boy uh sh shrimp on the babby uh rise up rise up lights i don't know 
Isn't that like a thing where you say like rise up lights and it sounds like razor blade or something? I look, I don't know. I don't know. I'm trying. I'm trying for Melba. We need Melba to show us. Like if she hears how bad my Australian accent is and how little I know, then she'll be like, oh, oh, I got I got to go fix her. I got to got to go fix her. <laughs> How do you how do you do an Australian accent? I literally don't know. Oh, oi, I go 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 fix. Okay. Anyway, Talara, thank you so much for the super chat. Oh god. You should do a spa cuz like you you go lift this and resting. It would be perfect. That's so true. I want to do um I can see it already. Like I can do a spa area of the bed and breakfast maybe or I can just have those kind of like little those things that go like Phew. Like the little, eh, it like sends water out into the air, you know? Also, did I change the counter for the Nook Mile ticket? I, I literally don't know. This is why I can't be trusted. I'm just going to change it anyway. <laughs> but like those little, oh, it's like an infuser. That's what it's called. It like sprays air. And oh my gosh, Primarina, thank you so much for the super chat. What the heck? You are literally too kind. I really missed your presence and after a really rubbish day you're making me feel so much better oh my gosh thank you for contributing to the switch fund i'm so glad that you could hang out i wish that this was melba for you and that would have been super hype but unfortunately it's this neon monkey but thank you so much oh my gosh i'm sorry i subjected you to my australian accent that's a thank you oh my gosh and what is wizard a member for two months thank you so much my dog says hi. Well, I say hello to your dog. She's a pity brown lab mix. Oh, that sounds so cute. I like that. I like that. I like all dogs. I think that they're just great. I want a dog really bad. I have like, my family has a dog, but I want a dog just because they're so precious. Okay, let's see. I need to change the counter. I cannot fix that. Or I cannot change it. I cannot you forget. That's the word. Oh my god, it's so hot in this room. I'm like melting right now. Okay, okay. Australian accent is just country British. It's like a British accent, but more nasal and more frontal placement. Oh, okay, okay. Ready. Hmm. <laughs> Oi, can I? <laughs> no, I really thought about that for a second. I was like, okay, nasal. Frontal placement, <laughs> and that was not that was not good. Oh, oi, Melba, Melba, are are you here? I look, I don't know, I don't know. I'm so sorry. I'm really trying. Like, I don't know how people do accents well. I can't do. Oh, it's a uh, cookie, cookie. Fab to meet you. Wow, that's a big trip. Shut your little face, even though you're cute. <laughs> What personality type is that? Like snooty or something? I don't like the personality type that's like, I'm gonna be a rock star. I'm one day I'll be too famous to be on your island. It's like, okay. Then then go. <laughs> I don't know. Sorry. Sorry, I'm not good enough. It's getting better. Oh no, no. I don't think so. I appreciate you lying to me though. I'm gonna blame it on having driven for a while and being in a hot room. That's why it's so bad, you know? Charlie, you're a little aggressive. Was I aggressive? I don't know what I said. As an Aussie, that is not a good explanation of our accent. Okay. At least I don't think I sound like that. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. It's so hard. To, like, I don't get how people do accents. Like, how do you hear somebody's... Like, it just, you speak completely differently. It baffles me. Like, the people that can do those kind of, like, impressions, they'll just, like, whip out a Mickey Mouse, and then they'll be like, oh, Michelle. And then they'll do, like, an Austria. It's like, oh, my gosh. Look at you. I can't. All I can do is a good Yoshi impression, and that's it. And at first, people are like, ooh, that's really good. And then they're like, yo, can you do anything else? And I'm like, no, but would you like me to do the Yoshi again? Would you like me to say Yahoo once more? Oh gosh, please let it me be Melba. Good eye, might. Oh god. Oh. That was bad. That was really bad. Oh god. I don't like that one. I don't like that one. Oh god. 
And Carolina, thank you so much for becoming a sprig and getting membership. Welcome to Sprigdom. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. And a B&B &B with a spa area sounds perfect. I think the word you were looking for is diffuser. Yes, that is the diffuser. Like, I want it to be spraying sweet scents into the air that calm you. Like, eucalyptus. And you're like, ooh, what a lovely spa. And Melba's like, thank you. It's it's my lunch. You know? It just kind of makes sense to me. Okay. Okay, that was not a good aim, mate. I can't... I give up. I give up. It's okay. Yoshi accent? Well, now we need to hear the Yoshi. It's like, I get embarrassed. I feel like I can't. It's like, I don't know. It's always so weird because you say you can do a Yoshi impression and then you do one and then people are like, oh. And then like, I don't know. But it, it's like, wahoo! Does that sound like Yoshi? I feel like it sounds like Yoshi. I've been pre perfecting it for like 20 years. <laughs> but yeah, that's like my only thing. And then people are like, oh, oh, nice. And then that's kind of it. That's so good. Thank you. Oh, my God. <laughs> it was very impressive. Oh, my God. Thank you. I've just listened to Yoshi a lot, I guess. I don't really know. They should have had you voice act in the Mario movie. <laughs> oh, my God. Nintendo, my DMs are open. Please. Actually, I don't know if I want to work in the Mario movie, but if you do a Yoshi game, <gasps> what are you? Oh, it's Vic! Oh, oh, that is the opposite of Yahoo. That is ooh hi. I don't like Vic very much. Oh God. Okay. It's okay. We're gonna be okay. You know, we're only at twenty tickets. Like, we've barely just begun. Everybody, the the adventure is starting. Vic is tired, terrifying. That's not a villager. That's a man. Okay. Yes, <laughs> that's yes, that's literally I think that's my problem with Vic is that it just looks like a guy. It's just like a, a whole man. Like you're supposed to be a, an animal. I don't know. I don't I'm scared. <laughs> What's his catchphrase? Hobnobbin? I wasn't I literally wasn't listening, but that's horrible. I don't like that. Oh, goodness. How many tickets do you have? I have like 150 tickets or something absurd. And yes, yeah, somebody did predict 29 tickets would be Melba. So, you know, yeah, it was not sneaky. 29 tickets. So I'm keeping that on my noggin. And, you know, we're going to get there. Island 29. And we're going to be like, oh, good eye bite. Oh, shrimp on the bobby. I don't know. I feel bad. I don't know like anything. It's like the equivalent of when people say like, oh, you lived in Maine, like, so lobster and blueberries. And you're like, yeah, that is, yep. And it's like, do people drive tractors? It's like, yes, they definitely do. That is a thing. Like, I feel like people are just so tired of shrimp on the Barbie, probably. Also, anchovies kind of cute, but the hair really gets me. I don't know what it is about the hair. It's off-putting. So I must leave. Okay. Ooh, ah, what happens when Al is on the 29th ticket? Monica, why would you say these things to me? I, that was so uncalled for. What happens when Al... If Al is the 29th ticket, I'm... I'm stream ends. <laughs> oh, goodness. Shrimp on the Barbie hurts because I didn't even know what a shrimp was because they're called prawns. So that's just fake. It's only Americans that say shrimp. How the heck is it po That is even worse, I feel. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna start saying prawn prawns on the bobby. Just to, like for the justice, you know? My impact. I need to write this wrong. That's so like... Oh my gosh. Who even said shrimp on the barbie first? Like George Washington? Which American was like, I'm just gonna name... I'm just gonna say it's shrimp on the barbie. Wow, I feel lied to. But it's okay. Prawns is better than shrimp. I agree. I feel like prawn. Prawn sounds good. Charlie, check tickets and inventory. I think you missed one on the counter. Oh, crud. That's okay. I'll just, I don't. 
We're just... I can... Eh. Eh. I believe you. We'll just... We'll just go like that. And now we should be good. Can you name your next island prawn? Honestly? Oh. I don't like it. Honestly, I feel like it would be a good... It would be a really cool idea to do, like, an underwater island theme. I mean, somebody has definitely done that before, but just having, like, marina and, like, all the different water type of the animal villagers and then kind of having just water decor. I think that would be so cool. And it would be named Prawn, and it would be cute. But yeah, I have so many ideas for islands. I just... I just really want to get started. I just want to start a new island, but this island is taking every part of my soul. Okay. Let's -a go. I cried when I got Al on my island. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. I cried too, honestly. There were days for sure. I would just like wake up and get like clapped in the eyes with the cheeks and I'd just be like, please. Nintendo. But it's okay, because he's gone now. He's other people's problems now. Okay. Oh my gosh, idea. One part of the island is the beach, and as you go further, it becomes the sea. <gasps> that is, like, actually such a good idea. I'm I'm shook a little bit. Oh, it's, it's Leopold. Yes, I knew that. Oh my gosh. I honest, honestly, Leopold is probably my favorite lion that there is, but I still am not the biggest fan. Okay. When is the next Animal Crossing month video? It is, like, actually done. I just need to do a thumbnail because I'm... I don't know. I was on a trip, like I've said, like, 20 times probably. I did, like, a really, really long road trip, and then now I'm getting on a plane in, uh, two days? So I'm gonna be... I'm gonna be in... London, good old London. I'm going with my dad and it's gonna be so fun and it's my dad's first time traveling internationally and it was like it's just I'm so excited for it. It's gonna be so cool. But yeah, but then the downside of that is that um that means I don't have much time to do stuff and my head is like there. It's been hot in London. Oh gosh, that's <laughs> great. Perfect. I'm gonna be like dying over there. Shark theme Shrek. I just read that as shark. What the heck? Shrek theme park was that good. It okay. Shrek Adventure was on it was unironically a great experience, but I did feel weird being the only one there that was like over ten, you know? Like when they were asking you to sing the I'm a believer song to get like the 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 what whatchamacallit, like the cart. A magic cart going again i was like oh okay all right i'm gonna let the kids take the take the real the but the the, the, the the reins the reins on this one my english today is not englishing it's awful it's way too hot in the uk riff when you go to london oh perfect it's really hot here too i don't know what the heck is going on oh well We'll see. I don't know what it's considered hot in Maine, but it's going to be 30 degrees tomorrow, which is 86 degrees Fahrenheit. Oh, yeah, that's like kind of hot. That's that's pretty hot. No, I don't mean to say like, mm, yeah, that's it's kind of hot. No, that is hot. But I feel like that's not outlandish. Like, I feel like we have that here sometimes, you know? We'll see how it goes. I'm not sure. Ugly villager themed island. I'm not even kidding. I was looking through the list of villagers today and it literally occurred to me. I was like, some of these guys are really ugly. I could do a whole island with just the ugliest villagers. But then I'm like, what would the island theme be? I mean, I don't know. It's also like, do I want to embark on that project when I have other projects I'm more excited about? Probably not. But I feel like they also crave justice as ugly villagers you know like i feel a little bad and tweak thank you so much for getting a membership welcome to spreakdom i really appreciate it thank you thank you you are too kind 102 in arizona oh my gosh how are you alive 
I'm like, I feel privileged to be able to like decide to take the fan out of my window to just be like, hmm. I don't want the fan sound in my in my stream. I'm going to turn it off. Like, oh my gosh, I think I'd die if I did that. I'm dying a little bit right now, but like if it was 100 degrees, goodness gracious. But yeah, it's 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 not that hot here, but it's been so hot that like for some reason all day the fire alarms have just been going off randomly. Like the humidity of the day has been setting off all the fire alarms. So like I woke up just the, like the fire alarm in the front hallway going off and then like every I, sometimes I've just heard oh, no my money oh I forgot to okay and then like my neighbor like right before I started the stream and like right after I started it I could hear it through the closet like my neighbor's fire alarm was just going hammy and they were like trying to stop it and it wouldn't it just would not stop but like mine hasn't gone off yet so I don't know if that's like means it's malfunctioning or like I'm just lucky I'm not sure but it's okay oh my gosh it's so hot like everywhere jeez what if the fire is just really sneaky and then I guess I'm like dying it's like sneaky enough that my like fire detector is just it's oblivious the fire is a fan of Charlie Sneaky Bartley. Yeah, it's like, I, I can't disrupt a Charlie stream, you know? Everybody else's life, meh. But no, not a stream. <laughs> I appreciate that fire. Thank you. Charlie is secretly on fire. Yeah, you know, that's probably the more likely scenario. Is that I'm just, like, about to combust at any second. Into flame. But it's okay. I'm okay with that, you know? As long as we get Melba... <laughs> Whatever. Light me on fire, okay? It's fine. Okay. <laughs> now it's the 25th island, and Melba has five letters in her name, so 25 plus 5 is 30. So you should get Melba at the 30th island. Uh, okay. I see. I see your logic there, and I respect it. Thank you, Eden. And we ha so we have a 29, island 29 prediction, and an island 30 prediction. Those are, those are pretty close. I mean... We'll see who ends up being right, but jinkies. I don't even know. Al should rule the world. You know, I really don't think so. <laughs> Al got president. He's not even he's not even the president. He just like caught it like a disease. I just feel I don't know. Al is just the worst and I'm sick of him. <laughs> Al for president. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And we're getting Melba. Melba is like the cutest little koala villager. And we're going to be adding her to our lovely quinoa in replacement of Tammy P. Bear. <gasps> oh, it's Henry. Oh, God, I'm so good. I need to do that video like literally right now where I guess all the villagers names. Look at me. I've gotten every single person right, except for the people that I don't know. So I just cleverly do not say their name. Oh, that's so exciting. Henry. I read him. I read him like a little froggy book. Oh my gosh. And like, I really want to do more face cam stuff and do more videos in real life, but I can't do it until my until I move to my new place where I'm more established. But I feel like that's like a video I would want like a face cam for. I feel like that you would want to see the gears like grinding in my brain, you know? At least like if somebody did a video, I would want to see that. So it's not going to happen now. It's not going to happen tomorrow, but it's in like a month. Who who knows? Oh, 27. Okay. This is going well. <laughs> this is going well. Make Al the house he deserves in Happy Home Paradise. Oh, I already did. <laughs> and I think it was filled with chainsaws, which, you know, kind of, kind of tracks. Oh, gosh. Two more islands until we get Melba. I mean, it was a good ride, everyone. It really was. Thanks for being here. No, just kidding. Please don't leave me. Oh, it's the angry bird pig. Dang it, Rasher. I'm a mite fuzzy on that pot. 
I don't know. I tried to I tried to like get get the accent down, but I don't know what's going on there. <laughs> okay, that's okay. I'm trying to like will it into existence, you know? I go 79, write it down. Okay. Writing it in my brain. 79, 29, and 30. Oh, only one more island. One more island, and then it's gonna be like, geez, what was the point? But it's okay. La da da da. Rasher's so nostalgic. He was on my new leaf game. That's so. I find it so cute how everybody has like those villagers that they just have the most intense nostalgia for because of like Wild World or New Leaf. Like it makes my heart so happy. Like this, th like Animal Crossing is just such a cute game. Like it's a game you can play when you're like nine years old and you're hiding under the covers or like waking up early because you don't know what time traveling is yet. And it's also a game you can play when you're like 20 whatever or like 80. Like remember that grandma that had like an <laughs> like a like a 12,000 hour island and she like did a tour of it. Like that's going to be me. I'm going to be like, oh, and this is Wolfgang. He's, he's on my wild world. You probably don't know what that is. Like that's going to be me. I swear to God. Like you think this channel's dying when I age? No, I'm going to be here. I literally hate you. Who are you? Canberra? Oh, shut up. Shut up. I swear I thought that was Melpa. I swear. <laughs> okay, get out of my life. Get out of my life. I can't believe you just did that to me. From behind, too. It was like, it was like, it looked just like her. <laughs> I just got trolled so hard I could die. I could literally die. Canberra is on like my, my blacklist now. I hate you. If I ever see you. Watch yourself. One more island. Oh, you're so right, Lucky Duck. Thank you so much. Let me just... 29. Ooh. It's been fun. Can't wait. If that if, if Canberra just ruined it for us and took all of the koalas out of this world, I'm going to be literally so upset. <laughs> Melba vibes, everybody. Everybody, channel your Melba. Channel your Melba. Calm waters. Melba doesn't want the rocky water. Actually, Melba doesn't want any water because she's a koala and she doesn't drink water. So never mind. Forget the calm waters. Don't don't think about water. She's not going to come. <laughs> ah, koalas. I've put everything I, I own on Island 46. Okay. 29, 30, 46, 78. These are the numbers. These are the numbers. I don't know why that made me think of that, like, One Republic song. <laughs> Which is kind of a banger, I will say. Uh, I mean, it's been real, guys, but, you know, I hate to... Oh, it's Marina again. Why do I see Marina? Every villager hunt. Don't you have places to be, like the ocean? How are you even breathing on land? Actually, that's a great question. How? How? What? Confused. But over it. Melba's looking a little pink. Yeah, Melba looks a little different, I must say. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, well, that's okay, because then we also have... Island... 30, which is right now, but... Somebody else said that it was going to be Island 30, so maybe it was, like... Like, I think it's Not Sneaky. Not Sneaky got the vibe that they were like, oh, Island 29, but then somebody else was like, no, no, no. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, 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 da, 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 da. Orville, Orville, Orville. But then it was like really, really close. It was an island around there, but it was actually 30. You know what I mean? Like sometimes your vibes just get skewed. <laughs> okay. Oh, I can't wait to see Melba. Have we seen Melba before? Like, I don't know. Does anybody remember better than me? Have we actually seen Melba with our eyes ever? I can't remember, but part of me feels like maybe once. Like, I feel like I vaguely remember going onto an island and seeing her and being like, oh, she's so cute. What the heck? And then being like, okay, bye. No, we haven't? Oh. Oh, I don't know. Maybe I made that up in my head. Oh, that's not Melba. That's a whole bird. What the frick? Oh my. No, no, no. Okay. 
Okay, the vibes were all skewed. The vibes were... They were crossed. The wires are crossed. Okay, so what are we holding out for now? Like, 78? <laughs> like, what the, what the heck? It's okay. We're gonna get Melba, and it's gonna be great. Does Melba even exist? I am scared. Canberra did ruin it. I hate that guy. Okay, I'm gonna look up Melba. Melba? Okay, the Animal Crossing Villager is the first thing that pops up. Okay, I'm gonna look up Melba Bread. Oh, wait, let me... I don't want to mess this up and then accidentally... Oh! I literally said... I, my, all my brain cells were working on that one task. How did you possibly mess it up? You guys. Get it together. Okay. Let's see. Melba... Each Melba is a dessert of peaches and raspberry sauce with vanilla ice cream. Oh, that sounds just lovely. There's also a restaurant named that. And it's an Australian operatic soprano, which is so fun. Mel but that's not bread. <gasps> Melba bread. It's real. What the heck? Carbalicious low bread. Wait, what? Oh, it's so cute. It kind of looks... I don't know. I can't touch it, obviously, so I don't know. But is it the kind of bread that's, like, a little crunchy? It, it seems like it'd be crunchy. Uh, Melba? Melba, is the bread na na you're named after crunchy? Oh my god, it's freaking clay. I The amount of times I've seen clay makes me... It, like, I'm, I could lose my mind, honestly. I do not want to see that hamster again. In fact, I would be fine not seeing any hamster again. I don't like any of them. Oh, and there's not even a bottle to soothe my my little brain okay okay yeah so is melba bread crunchy back to the thing that matters <laughs> 500 dollars on island 36 okay well we'll see i hope so i only like the mob boss hamster oh okay action frog you're so right mob boss hamster is kind of fantastic like the peak of character design you know marlo See that? My knowledge? My literal knowledge. Marlo. I could name any villager right now. Like, try me. Sorry, my brain cells are working really hard. Okay, use ticket. Okay, perfect. Melba is probably shortened for Melbourne, which is a city. Oh, that's true. It does kind of seem like it. I can see that for sure. Maybe it's not the bread. <laughs> my bad. Oh gosh. Island 37. Island 37. We gotta we gotta get the five hundred dollars for that person. I forget who. I'm trying to scroll through and see, but I, I forget. I'm so sorry. It's okay. We'll get there. We'll get there. Me. <laughs> okay, okay. Melba. 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 Here she is, everybody. Thanks for sticking around so long. That's a bird. Every single... Ooh, look at that butterfly, though. Don't these sell for, like, a good amount of money? Hey. Get back here, please. Why? Uh, okay, I give up. I give up. I give up. It flew away. It doesn't want to be... Oh, my God. If you get Melba next island, I will gift a dollar. I appreciate that. You don't need to. And it's, it's, I mean, it's only Island 32. We're waiting for 37, but we'll see. <laughs> Melville looks so weird on these islands. What a weird glitch. I know, like, Nintendo's being a little wacky today. Animal Crossing, what are you doing? That's not Melba, silly goose. You're getting trolled by another butterfly? I get trolled by, like, every butterfly I try to catch. I hate to say it. Every time I try to get a butterfly, it just, it, it jukes me. It goes to the other side of the river, and then I gotta go try and get it. It's like, come on. Like, what what do you even have to do? You're a butterfly. Okay. Ooh. Melba. Calm eucalyptus. Calm eucalyptus. Charlie, did you know if you visit Brewster 51 times, he'll give you Brewster Gyroid? <gasps> oh, 
Oh my god. No. That is so cool. Okay. I actually... Okay. I think I said this in another, in another stream, so this is kind of a spoiler, but then also kind of not the spoiler. But, um... It'll probably be in the, the month seven video anyway, but I've made it a new goal to get every single sticker. Oh, it's the hamburger sheep. I don't know. Th that really looks like a hamburger to me. Is that just... I feel like that... Oh, no, it is wearing a hot dog shirt. So that was obviously the design. I just don't know why they did that. <laughs> like, they could have easily just not, you know? But yeah, I think... um. I what was I saying oh yeah my goal is to get every single sticker like Nook Miles sticker on the island where you have like you get the stickers for if you do like I don't know like 20 stretching sessions or like breaking tools 50 times or something so uh yeah so I'm getting every single one of those and because of that I have been getting a lot of cups of coffee at the roost so eventually I will get it I think that Brewster actually just gave me this morning, like, the pro coffee grinder or something. So, maybe I'm on my way. Who knows? Who even knows? I'm telling you, it's 46. It feels like everybody is getting different vibes. Oh my gosh, $500 on 36. Right. LR is kind of bad. That's okay. I'm going to get you that $500 because Melba's going to be on 36 and it's going to be like, oh my gosh, that's, that's so crazy. And it's going to be great. But like, this isn't Melba because still, oh, it's that squirrel. Oh my gosh. I kind of, I can't tell if I like that squirrel or not, but yeah. And, and it is, I'm really happy that we did Melba too, actually, because Melba is a koala. And we don't have a koala yet. And like I said, I want to have one of, like, each different kind of villager. I don't want to have any duplicate species on the island. I want the, the variety. And people keep saying that Marshall and Poppy are the same. And they're both squirrels. First of all, Marshall is my first campsite villager, so he's an exception. Second of all, I'm pretty sure Poppy's a chipmunk, so get get check yourself before you wreck yourself <laughs> and that's all i have to say on that but also that's just my excuse that i made up so that i could keep them both because i love them both i just think the squirrels are really cute oh goodness dress up like bread to summon her i could definitely try i don't really have like bread but i i can i can try Oh, goodness. Okay. One more island until Melba. Melba got removed from the game? I don't think so. I mean, I know that there's some weird rule where... Oh, dang it. Oh, I really... I thought if I was, like, silent and if I let her get the space... <gasps> what freaking frog? Is this wart... Junior? Oh my god, I'm so good! Did you see that? I literally... I mean, he is covered in warts, so like, you know, but I knew it was Wart Junior. But anyway, yeah. I forgot what I was saying. I was saying something mildly important. It's, it's gone. It's gone. It's gone. Oh, I know there's that stupid thing where there's like a villager queue or something and that villagers can like... I don't know, like, there's some villagers that you can just never get. And I never really understood how that works. So, if, if, if she's in my queue, I'll be very upset. Charlie, what's your craving? Oh, yeah, um, um, this is so, like, do people have cravings? Do they crave things, like, all the time? I feel like, I don't know, uh... Uh, I don't, I could do with like a, like a, like a sugar cookie. That's such an awful vanilla answer. That's so bad. Like who, who's, who craves a sugar cookie? What the heck? Yes. Yes. Cobb salad. True. I don't know. I like don't crave things. I don't know why. Oh my God. I'm indecent. Don't look. I'm trying to find out what looks most like bread. Um, 
Yesterday I was craving spicy chicken sandwich. Oh my gosh. Like from Popeyes. I'm obsessed with the Popeyes spicy chicken sandwich. Like, come on. Do you have like the per you did you get permission to be that absolutely scrummy? I don't think so. Okay, so this is the most bread like I have. I could do the wiener again, but it wasn't very successful for us last time. I guess I could do. I feel like this is kind of bread like <laughs> just joined. Why are we trying to look like bread? Great question. So the villager that we're trying to get is named Melba and Melba is apparently like a kind of bread. It's like a toast in in Australia because because Melba's a koala, you see. So we're trying to be bread and you know, when I like say it like that, it doesn't really make much sense. Also, is this island 37? I think it is. But oh. Uh oh, this is the one. What a glutinous outfit. Oh, I know. Island 37. Is it gonna be Melba? Is it? Please? I pray? Oh, 36? Did I do it wrong? Okay. Maybe my bad. <laughs> I thought it was... No, I think this is Island 37. Hold on, hold on. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. I am bread. I am bread. There is no way. Oh, God. Wait, this bunny? Look at it. I'm going to look at it. I'm going to guess the vibes. I'm going to guess the name. This bunny is named Carmen, right? Oh, my God. God, I'm so good. Oh my God. It's disgusting. It's disgusting. Somebody stop me. I'm a piece of bread and I'm too good. I knew it. I knew it was Carmen. Melba is just in cosplay. Uh, yeah. I don't know. The ears seem like hard to disguise. Okay. That's okay. That's okay. I'm sorry I lost you $500, but it's it's going to be okay. She has Melba's dress. Are you kidding? I lost my 500 bucks. I'm so sorry. It's okay. I'll get it back for you. We'll find a money island. That looks like a rabbit from far away. You're kind of right about that. Oh god. I don't understand the rabbits. Can somebody like tell me, like explain the rabbit lore? I don't get it. Is like, it, like, so there's like rabbits and they're like, they're like, ah, but then Mario's there too. And they're shooting out of cannons and like going in porta potties and stuff. Is that like, what the heck is rabbits? I don't get it. They're rabid. Rabbits on crack. Yeah, that's kind of, <laughs> that's yeah, pretty much. That's kind of what I get from it. I don't understand. Rabbits that go blah. I've heard Therm do that before and it was horrifying. So I can only imagine. Oh, I got your $500 back. Oh, it's the freaking like mammoth pig. What the? Or elephant, I mean. Tucker. You look like a crude. And I love that. I like, has, does anybody remember the movie The Crudes? Like what the, what the heck? Melba looks weird. That ain't Melba. Tucker is so cute. I know, right? I feel like you could do a really cute like ice age or like prehistoric kind of like island. You could have Tucker. You could have Han, the uh like Yeti guy, which I don't really know how that fits. But for some reason, it feels like it does. <laughs> Rabbits equal white minions. Oh yeah, they are just like little white, like little little rabbit minions instead of yellow minions. I feel like you're you're right on with that. How do you think the world would change if minions never existed? Sorry, I don't know that where that came from. I just that kind of popped out of my, my head. I don't know. 
And it's just like, what would what would happen? What would be different? Oopsie. Oopsie. Okay. Okay, I was trying to change the counter at the same time, so I missed some money, but that's okay. Charlie wouldn't be born? Yes, my existence entirely hinges upon the minions, for sure. No more Facebook memes. Facebook would be bearable. That's true. But, like, think of the implications. Would stuffed crust pizza be as popular? I'm not so sure. Eh. Oh, this is so annoying. I wish it stacked automatically. Like, not to say that the minions single-handedly, like, increase the popularity of stuffed crust, but kind of that's the vibe I get, you know? Like, I feel like I really love stuffed crust, and I never met people that liked stuffed crust that much, and then suddenly, in a matter of moments, everybody was like, ooh, stuffed crust, and I was like, okay, yeah, I've been on the stuffed crust train. What the heck? Okay. More, more money. Part of me wants to see you do an all-wolf island. That would be kind of cool. I feel like I don't know what I, like, what I do. But I do really like the wolves. I like Wolfgang a lot. I like Fang, I think. Chief, Audi. Like, they're all so cool. Like, the wolves are probably the one category of Animal Crossing villagers that it's just, like, every single one is a hit. Like, there is not one wolf that I would be disappointed to get, you know? Stuffed crust was wildly popular in the 90s. I guess they just brought it back. Oh. Okay, never mind. Maybe the minions weren't responsible for the rise of stuffed crust. <laughs> for mine, my bad. And Museo Grek reads, thank you so much for the sticker. I appreciate it. I love that little sticker. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for being here. You're too kind. I really like my it's like my my daily dose of rainbow, and I like it. Just a little rainbow. So cute. Okay. This is, this is, this is... Doing this is so much easier when you have the ability to touch the gamepad, but when you have to do this with just a controller, it, it actually drives me bonkers. I'm done. I'm done. Just kidding. It's bothering me. It's bothering me. And now I have to drag it all the way over here. Good gravy. Please be something good. It's from Billy. <gasps> Wait, Billy sent us a golden samurai suit? Oh my god, and all the things you guys said about Billy. And he just sent us, like, the coolest recipe of all time. How dare you? Shame on you. Shame on you. How do you feel now about letting Billy die? Probably not too hot. Okay. And Melanie, thank you so much for the super chat! Hello, Chonky Bonky. <laughs> Happy to make this stream for FD babysit. Maybe having another melon stream will help manifest Melba. <gasps> oh my gosh, you're so right. Now it's gotta happen. We're dressed as bread. We've got the Mel vibes. We've gotta just do it. Bill is the realist. <laughs> Sorry, Bill. I know. I feel like there was a lot of Bill hate that I saw, and I just don't know why, because I think Bill is adorable. Maybe his house is ugly, but you know what? We have the happy home designer, whatever the heck, DLC. It doesn't matter. I also think it's hilarious that his... Like, his... I don't even know. Just all of his bio information when I was, like, reading through the wiki just actually made me chuckle. I think he's so good. Carly, you need to say Melba five times, then say bread five times, after that spin three times, and you will melbically get Melba. Okay, yeah. No, that, that feels like it makes sense. Okay. Okay. Melba, 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 Melba. Bread, 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 bread. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Melba? Oh, it's this one again. Quinn. I like Quinn. Except this is the same exact island layout. Like, have you gone anywhere? Also, why would you take me to the same exact island, Wilbur? That's so rude of you. Goodness gracious. That's okay. We're only on island 41, you know? <laughs> We're only on island 41. 
that worked, I would have screamed. Oh, me too, for sure. I literally, I don't know. The fact that if you haven't seen the dock villager hunt yet, you've got to. Like, it was, it was pure magic. Like, I couldn't even, I couldn't even fathom what had happened. I'm not even kidding you. It broke me for like a week. 42 is the one. 46 is coming up. We've got a lot of bets here. This is 41, I think, so... We're gonna get it. Dog hunt was not real. The dog hunt was like... The, like, I don't know. I don't remember it. It was all a blur. It was really a fever dream. Like, one of those streams where you finish, and then you wake up the next day and you're like, did that even, like, happen? I don't know. Okay. Okay. Really feeling 46. I like that, Aaron. I like that. Maybe? <gasps> Hi, Lobo. Oh my god, look at that. I've learned! That was another thing is that I accidentally... I saw Lobo and I said, Hi, Kyle. And it was not Kyle. But now look at me. <laughs> look at me. First try. I'm so proud of myself. Charlie, if you get Melba on 88, I will send you my personal Switch Lite. Oh my gosh. I don't know if I can record with a Switch Lite. And I'd also love if you had it to play. <laughs> but I appreciate the sentiment. <laughs> After Dog Hunt stream ended, I feel like a piece of my soul dissolved. Very fair. Very fair. I did too, a little bit. Happy Pride Month, everyone. Sorry, that was kind of out of nowhere. No, no, it is, it is, it is necessary. Also, oh my gosh, I want to show you guys something like really quick. It's kind of spoilery, a little bit of a spoiler, but I'm so excited about it. So I'm just going to show you real fast. But I wanted to do, okay, I was going to do a villager hunt for like a pride month villager. And then the only like rainbow villager was this really ugly elephant or something. And I was like, okay, no, no. But look at what, look at, I'm doing like rainbow flowers around the town hall and it looks so cute i'm trying to get all of the types of flowers in every single color so we're kind of it's kind of a work in progress but i think it's so adorable i love it so much sorry i just had to show you i'm so excited but it's okay <laughs> i think it's so cute i'm like i don't know sitting in my chair just do playing it and like growing all these flower hybrids and i'm like hee 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 like geeking over my rainbow flowers. I don't know why. I just think they're adorable. It's not even that big of a thing. And Melanie, thank you so much. Charlie, if you ever need flowers, hybrid or not, I have way too many on mine. That's very funny timing, but thank you. I actually have all of the flowers. And if I don't have it, then I am have the like pattern already. I'm like gardening out of my mind right now, you know? Like, I have all the hybrids growing in, at the moment, so it's gonna be good. Charlie, I didn't even see. I know, that was like the timing on that. The the Mel magic today. Melba's gonna sense it. If it's not 42, I'll eat my shoe. Oh my gosh. Well, I guess we'll see. <laughs> we'll see if your shoe remains uneaten. I hope so. I'm getting the Melba vibes. Okay. Oh, no, it's the little tea pig. I don't uh, no elephant. What the heck? It's called like tia Tiana, Tiara. I don't remember, but dang it. Now you're going to have to eat your shoe. <laughs> Just kidding. Please don't eat your shoe. Tia, that's what it is. Please don't eat your shoe. Please don't eat your shoe. <laughs> oh, God. I like Tia is on my island. I don't want her. I would love if she left. Start seasoning the shoe. No, do not eat your shoe. Oh my god. Sometimes I feel like... And this is not an insult because I love you all so much. Like, I love streaming and interacting with you. It is literally so fun. But sometimes I, like, say things and then in my head it just feels like when... Like, I used to be... Like, I used to teach kind of environmental science stuff to little kids like water cycle and stuff like that 
and it would be like i would literally have to say stuff like that where i'd be like mason please don't eat your shoe Pl please okay put the down and sometimes i just feel that way you know i don't know like it, it's kind of like having to round up a bunch of like k through five people little little humans oh isn't that like the number two most popular villager right now i don't get why like fuchsia I was so confused when I saw that. Like, it's neon. That's a, a Sharpie highlighter. I don't understand. But it's okay. I respect it. I respect the rankings, I believe. Maybe Melba will appear if we all eat a shoe. You know, I'm not at that point of, like, descent, too. And so, like, I'm not there yet, but... Maybe. <laughs> oh, gosh. I don't like her, no offense. I don't like her either. I think she's kind of meh. She's kind of mid. Not a fan. Okay, okay. I wanna fly. And I gotta get on the nook mile ticket. Seasons my converse, not the chucks. <laughs> Please don't eat them. <laughs> oh no, no. Everybody's eating their shoe. Everybody's eating their shoe. Please. <laughs> Oh no. She will hear the crunch of the shoe and go on an island to get away from that. Yeah, you're gonna repel her. Oh god. Do a stream where you bake a cake in the shape of your sneakers and eat the shoe. I literally want to do so much baking and cooking videos. Like, I want to bake stuff. I feel like that'll be so fun. Ever since I made that, like, really cursed carrot cake and 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 suspended it in jello i was like i want to do more videos like that that's so fun and melba will be there too so it'll be actually what oh what the heck i did i didn't even have time to register that villager because i was like there's nobody here <laughs> a melba shaped cake oh that would be so cute oh, i kind of want to make cookies that are like all my villagers oh i really want to now eee! that would be so fun Owl cheek shaped bread. I hate that so much. Oh no. That's horrible. Oh my gosh. Okay. We're gonna get there. We're gonna get there. Island 45. Feeling good. That's a good number. I'm actually awake for your streams. Hello from Australia. Oh my god. Can you quickly like wrangle... Oh crud. Can you wrangle Melba? <laughs> Just like toss her onto an island for us melba is a koala and we need no i keep clicking the wrong thing what is my brain I i'm stalling so that you can get melba <laughs> but thank you for being here i appreciate it okay now yes ma'am i shall <laughs> we stalled for time so hopefully that was enough okay Okay, if this is random, but if I owned a koala, I feel like I would definitely name it Melba. Even though it just feels like Melba doesn't look like most koalas, because I feel like most koalas are a little ugly, but Melba's really cute. And she's not, like, gray. She's kind of brown. I don't know. Can koalas be brown? I've never even seen a koala. I don't know. They could be fake, for all I know. What a shoe in jello. I could. I don't know why I would, but I could. The same bird? Oh, no, no. Okay, okay. Take me, take me away. Okay, I think that somebody said Island 47? Is that, a, is that just me? Do an Australian accent to lure her out? If you were here earlier, you would know that's not a good idea. <laughs> <laughs> that I can't do that. I, I sure gave it my darndest, though. And then I did a Yoshi, and everyone was impressed with that. So I think everybody forgot. It kind of, like, got wiped out of people's memory. So I think I should keep it that way. <laughs> okay. Ah, oh, put Vegemite on my shoes? I've never even tasted Vegemite. I don't even know what Vegemite is. I don't- I'm- is, is that- is that even sold in this continent? I don't know. Probably. Actually, I think I've seen this before. What- Vegemite. What is? 
Vegemite is a thick, dark brown Australian food spread made from leftover brewer's yeast extract with various vegetable and spice additives. I'm really sorry, but I don't like that. <laughs> huh. I don't even know. I'm trying to like piece together what that means, but Melba can help us? No, it's just a bird. This is such a bird heavy villager hunt. I feel like we've seen almost every single bird. We saw Quinn, we saw that guy, we saw the other guy, we saw the other person. Like, what the heck? You take that back right now. I, I'm sorry, I don't know. Add kimchi on your shoe if you're too weak for the Vegemite. Is that like in any way related? Wait, because I've had kimchi. Does it? No, that doesn't. That doesn't seem like it would be related. I don't know. I'm lost. I've been betrayed by 46. Yeah, we've all been betrayed, I feel. Why not dress up like an Aussie to attract her? Um, I mean, I think I already did. Kinda. I had like, I don't know. I had like my little adventurer outfit on. Maybe I should... Maybe the bread's not working. Maybe it's like kind of that thing again where it's like if we're the bread, then the bread can't come because Melba's bread, you know? And the adventurer outfit wasn't working. So what if I just dress up like Marmite or something? What if I do... Wait. Oh, I'll be a droplet of Marmite. Wait, this is literally perfect. Lit no Aussie can can resist correct i don't know okay okay head to toe i'm marmite baby uh okay and melanie thank you so much i'm on the highway to mel oh my gosh this is true i am on the highway to mel dress up as eucalyptus okay i'll do that next just right now, I'm feeling like the Marmite is the ticket. I don't really have, like, a brown shirt. I'll just do this. I look like a very well-educated piece of Marmite, I must say. Australians call it Vegemite? Oh, wait, what? How did... It... I thought I was saying Vegemite. I'm so confused. Is there a difference? I don't know. Marmite chic. I love it. Okay. Let us go. Now that we are a droplet of Marmite Vegemite, hopefully that'll attract Melba. It just feels like it would. Also, I don't think I changed the ticket thing, did I? I don't know. I don't know anymore. I thought Vegemite was a brand name. Yeah, I kind of got the sense that it was like chapstick, you know? Kleenex. Something. <laughs> And Graceman, thank you so much. I said it once. Australia equal Vegemite equal Melba. You're so right. I should have listened. Now, I'm dressed as a droplet of Vegemite. And, given this, Melba will come. It's just simple math. It's really not that hard. It's a weird black sludge. That, okay, look. That is offensive to me. As a droplet of Marmite, I, I don't appreciate that. Oh no, it's the bird again! Frick! What could I uh, possibly be? An acorn? Why are you here? A droplet of Vegemite? Yikes. What is it? What do you mean, yikes? I don't know. It's gonna be okay. We're gonna find her. What is up with the birds? I don't know. I feel like every single time I do a villager hunt, there's like one type of villager that I see more than others. And for this one, it has been the birds. It is so annoying. Like there's not even that many of them. At least be creative. Show me different things. It's gotta be 48. We'll see. What should I buy from Target? You should buy Vegemite. And I don't know, just to have and to hold, I guess. Okay. Okay, we're gonna get it. You need a yellow shirt to look like the Vegemite label. That's true. In my head, I'm the droplet of Vegemite. Like a little a knife full. And then I'm like, 
Boop. That's me, you know? Okay. Ooh. Calm eucalyptus. Calm eucalyptus. It'll be Island 55 because Melba is five letters and Koala is five letters. That is sound logic. I cannot... I have no qualms with that. Now I'm holding on for Island 55, but... No! No! I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. <laughs> oh god. Uh, it's gonna be okay. It's like, Do you have that purple galaxy hoodie? My friend in Australia always wears that. Could be good for Melba vibes. I don't know if I have that. I think I might have had it and then I sold it because I was like, when am I going to wear this, you know? Oh, man. Oh, gosh. Hold on. Okay. We're going to dress up as eucalyptus now. I feel like the Vegemite, maybe like it, koalas don't eat Vegemite. So it's kind of an understandable situation that she wouldn't be attracted to it. So we're going to try the eucalyptus and then we're going to eventually get to the reverse psychology for sure. Then we're going to be like wanting Al again. It'll be a whole thing. But for now. Okay, green. Uh, I don't have a lot of green things. I'm green. Green. No, green. No, green. No, green. Okay, that works. And then... Green. Stripey green. Okay, I, this is as eucalyptus-y as I'm gonna get, you know? I think it looks pretty good. Honestly, I think it, it looks super stylish and cool. Also, I think it's Island 49, so I'm gonna change that. Okay. Leaf umbrella would be perfect. Oh, you're so right. I do need the vaulting pole, though, so I probably wouldn't even be able to hold it. But I am a piece of eucalyptus now. It's going to be 58 because the population of koalas is 58,000. Maybe. I'm holding out. I'm holding out hope. Don't koalas get high off of eucalyptus? Is that true? I don't know. Maybe. It seems like they don't do much. If I was a koala, I'd eat you? Oh my gosh, thank you. Appreciate it. Melba, did you hear that? Please, Melba, please, Melba, please, Melba, please, Melba. Okay. Okay. Ah. Okay. Okay. Thank you so much. And it's a literally Quinn. Get out of my life. What the frick? What the frick? What the frick? I've seen that bird three times on this same island layout. Like, do you know what uh, Wilbur? Oh my God. I, I could lose it. I could lose my mind. I could. This is, this is, this is, I have the bird curse. I don't know. I don't know. I feel like this is the one. The next one. Yeah, it's okay. The next one is gonna be it, maybe. When just wants love? To be fair, I did love them, and then they happened again, and I was like, oh, I liked that one. And then the third time, it's like, okay, now you're just being, you're like, greedy. Like, why do you want this much attention? I gave you the love. Get out of my life, you know? That's just how I feel, though. Maybe that's just me, and I'm being aggressive for no reason. Koalas sleep so much because eucalyptus leaves don't provide a lot of nutritional value. Something that I think is very cool about koalas is that they have a longer, large intestine. Or no, like a larger, like... It's like a... cecum or something. It's like... Yeah, it's a cecum. It's like connected to the large intestine. And it's longer because it actually takes them so long to digest the fiber in the eucalyptus that they actually have to have a longer one so that it actually processes which i thought was so cool i was like wow look at you and your large intestine you little cutie not no i can't take it i can't the the like 
the neon pink villagers it's like a slap in the face it really is i just don't like i just don't like them like fuchsia and all of the i just don't like it's not a bird but i still hate them <laughs> I thought that elephant was Marina. Me too. And then the, I was like, that doesn't look... Something feels wrong. But I also thought it was Marina. Oh my gosh, I just had a craving for like a literal a moment. What was it? I had a craving for something. It was like cold. And it was slightly sweet. Oh, that was so exciting for a minute. Shoot! If it comes back into my head, I'll say it. But... I could I could go for some bubble tea, I feel. I feel like bubble tea is a craving I'm having right now. Shoot, what was my craving? I forget. Dang it. I was almost there. I was halfway. And I think I hope I don't say this wrong. Sinceta Sega? I hope I said that right, but thank you so much. I found Doc and Melba on my first and second island. The Aussies will support you. Oh my gosh. That is so lucky. I'm so jealous. But also you're embroidering. I want to embroider so bad. Like I feel like that would be so fun to be able to embroider stuff, but thank you so much. I really appreciate it. I hope you're embroidering. It's the freaking Karen hamster. How dare you? How dare you while I'm thanking somebody? I, how dare you? When I'm saying my thank yous, it just makes it even worse. Oh god. I said it right? Oh my gosh. I'm so glad. Thank you again. <laughs> I feel like the last person under the age of 35 who's never had boba some places just like don't have it and that's just the that's just the scoop on that one is like i don't know if you live in a place that just doesn't have a bubble tea store or something or you don't like want to make your own you're just kind of screwed like literally nowhere within <laughs> like a very large mile radius of me sells bubble tea and it hurts me inside deeply. But I did get bubbles. I got the like special. I have this one brand of bubbles that I always use for my bubble tea that I'm absolutely obsessed in. Obsessed with. Sorry, I read the word in, but I'm absolutely obsessed with it. It tastes so good. And I got myself a bag while I was at like an H Mart on my trip. And oh, baby, I'm going to make some bubble tea once I get Melba on this island right now. No, it's Hornsby! No, sweet baby boy! Oh my gosh! Schnozzle. Oh no. That is our first run-in with somebody that almost took the cake for our final villager. No way. Oh my gosh. That's that hurt. That that's hurting. Oh my gosh. <laughs> well, well, that's okay. We could have been done right now, but no, no, no. We've gotta find Melba. Oh no. It's gonna be okay. You know, when I was that up close to Hornsby. I didn't like him as much. I'm gonna say it. I was kind of like, meh. I like Melba. No, I really like Hornsby, but it's okay. We'll we'll get Melba and it'll be fine. Reverse cycle, reverse cycly. <laughs> I will. Okay, yeah. It's time for reverse psychology time. I want to get not Melba. You know, Melba more like mid. <laughs> so right. God, Oofus. I love your username. What the heck? Oofus is right. <laughs> Al, Al would be preferable, but I mean, if we can't get Al, I would take like Monique or Jambet the frog. I like Jambet the frog. Is what the... <gasps> Stop it. Stop it. Gonzo? You're kidding. That was so rude of you. Also, they all say, like, Australian things. They all say, like, a mite fuzzy because they're Australian. But, oh, frickin' frick. Frick, frick nugget in a frick nugget sandwich. Come on now. That was so rude. 
I hate it because they all kind of look the same and then you see their little ears and then you're like, oh my gosh, it's Melba and then you walk up and it's like, ah. Wait, no, it's working. It's working. That guy is Melba adjacent. Okay, okay, you're right, you're right. It's working. Also, Gonzo, like the Muppet, I was literally thinking the same thing. Like, that's a Muppet, right? The blue one that's like always in the cannons and he's like, Rah! okay, okay. You know, actually, oh shoot, I liked Gonzo. I I'd rather have Gonzo, frankly, than Melba. Melba? Schmelba. I thought Gonzo was way better. Or, you know, Canberra? Uh, that guy was kind of kind of sassy. I kind of liked his spunk. I thought it was great. I want that one. Or... Al. <laughs> I know. I hate to be a broken record, but like... Al is just like the pinnacle of... Like... A, a man, a monkey man. I don't know. I was trying to think. I was like, <laughs> sorry. I'm gonna tell you what just happened in my brain right now because I feel like it is. It, it sounded weird, but I I was saying he's like the pinnacle, and I was gonna say of a villager, and then I was gonna say of a monkey, and then somehow I said monkey man, and then I started thinking about that line in Twilight where she's like my monkey man, and it just like kind of broke me down. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, like Al would be good for sure oh my god i thought that was hornsby again who is this little goober oh you got a leaf as your hair that's cute tank wilderness training is that why you have like camouflaged leaf hair i kind of love that for you okay you lured the wrong koala oh hold on spider monkey that's what it is <laughs> just like <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah. It's the spider monkey line. What the heck? I've only seen Twilight once. My bad. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Oh, hate that. Oh my gosh. But also, this is like, I've had th these weird cycles where like, I get really obsessed with one topic, the same topic, like cyclically. Hence me saying cycle already. But, like, one of those things is the Loch Ness Monster. And, like, I don't know. Just like clockwork. Like, once a year, I just get super obsessed with the Loch Ness Monster for, like, I don't know, a week maybe? And, like, that's all I can think about. I, like, wake up and all I can think about is the Loch Ness Monster. And then I just, like, oh, that's, like, everything. That's all I can think of. And then... I don't know when I was watching Twilight and she was like, you nicknamed my daughter after the Loch Ness Monster. Now, whenever I have that Loch Ness Monster phase, all I can think about is that line because it is so bad. And it's just, it's just too much. My mom loves the Loch Ness Monster. I love the Loch Ness Monster. I literally love the Loch Ness Monster, even though it's like an actual catfish. Like, I'm pretty sure it's just a very large catfish. Oh my god, I just love- I just love that guy. I don't know, like, seeing all the- the plesiosaurs when I went to London was, like, magic. I was like, whoa, it's Nessie. Ew! Get out of here. That is not what I wanted. Oh god. No, Edward tells Bella to hold on tight, spider monkey, but later when they play baseball, Rosalie calls Emmett her monkey man. You're so right, you're so right, thank you, Bailey. That's exactly- Yes, it's like my monkey man. I remember her saying that and I died laughing. Oh my god. Oh gosh. Come to Scotland. I like want to. I'm gonna be in Ireland, but not Scotland. I would actually love to go to Scotland like so much. I would, it just seems so cool. I like the history and such. I'm into it. Why are the mice so ugly? I don't know, but he Nintendo, hear my prayer. I want fish villagers. I want villagers that are fish, and I want the special one to be the Plesiosaurus. And I want it on my island. And I want its name to be something cute like Annie, or like... I don't know, even Plessy or something. I don't care. I want fish villagers, and I want them now. <laughs> so, please deliver, thank you. Please and thank you. That is all I want in this life. Okay, okay. A clownfish villager I'd die for? You Like, there's so much potential there. Like, come on. 
Give us fish villagers! Please! Melba, what do you think of on that front about the fish villagers? Oh, it's Jambette! No! Wait. It's not Jambette. It's Diva. They're both purple. That was my bad. I could tell because she didn't have the PB&J lips. Okay. I manifested the wrong thing. I need to start- I need to do the- the- the reverse psychology again. This is just becoming too much. Okay, okay. Require assistance. I'm ready to go home. Thank you. Thank you. Island 57. We- I mean, we're doing pretty good in terms of islands. We haven't been to that many, so... You know. Dear Nintendo, please give us fish villagers. Here's the thing is, like... I used to write letters to like nintendo and all of the video game companies and stuff because i don't know i thought they were my friends or something as a kid and like like one example i don't know if i've ever said on stream is like i was playing the game spectrobes which is literally just pokemon but they're fossils and it's like one of my favorite games ever and i was playing spectrobes and i couldn't beat this one boss so instead of like just trying to beat it i typed up a letter to the game developers and i was like this boss is really hard. You did such a good job. Like, like, uh, these got me beat. Like, I hope I can beat it soon or something. Like, something stupid. And then they literally sent a letter back and it was so cute. And it was like, thank you so much. We're glad you're enjoying the game. Like, I really hope that you beat it or something. Like, really cute. So, in this vein of that, I should send Nintendo a letter saying, please make a fish villager. <laughs> you know? I feel like they might respond. Maybe if I pretend to be a little child. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know what that noise was that just came out of me. <laughs> okay, okay. We're fine, we're fine. That is adorable. I know! I literally- I still have the letter. It's in like my childhood bedroom. I have a box of all my old stuff and I still have it in there. It's so cute. And the Spectrobes just holds a, a nice place in my heart because of that. And if you go villager hunting, you find them in a little pond. Oh my god, stop, stop, stop. That's so freaking cute. I could die. I need this now. I need this now. I literally, I'm gonna, I'm not even kidding. I'm gonna end this stream. I'm gonna type up an email and I'm gonna be like, Hello, Nintendo. My name is... Uh... Sh shall we? <laughs> I couldn't think about to say Charlie in like a little baby voice, but I'll, I'll say... Can you please? I, I, my favorite animal is a fish and my fish just died. So can you please make a fish villager so that they can live with me forever? And then they're gonna, their heart's gonna be touched and they're like, oh, oh, poor little shall we? We'll make a fish villager for you, just for you. And then I'll be like, psych. Oh my God, I'm 23, you fools. And you just gave me a fish. <laughs> okay. Is that a frog again? <laughs> I wish you could see my face. I wish you could see my face right now. Oh, no. And no. I just like so much of my energy was just expended by that physical reaction that I just like choked. <laughs> I hate you. I hate you. I hate you, Boots. I hate you. I I can't. I can't. I can't. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, we only speak Japanese. Throw this letter away. Well, somebody spoke English enough to answer me. <laughs> I can learn Japanese just how to say it. Like for some reason japanese is one of the languages and i don't know if this is just me and how my brain works or if other people have this but japanese is one of those languages that my brain just does not like and it's not even like i think the language is cool i think it's interesting i like the way that it ties to the culture and everything but like my brain can't do it it's the same with french french and japanese i will never be able to learn because the words like fall out of my brain like, I just, I can't do it. It does, I can't comprehend it. But then there's other languages, like Spanish was really easy for me. And like, I don't know. I know like the Korean alphabet. And I feel like every time I learn any Korean, like that sticks like really, really easily to my brain. But then I learn Japanese and I'm just like, no, no, nope, nope. I hate you. 
I wish I knew how to say that in Japanese, but I can't, so I'll say it in English. <laughs> French is usually easier. I feel like French is really hard for me because the way that my brain, like, thinks, it just, like, ties the languages I learn together, so I literally can't learn French because it's so tied to Spanish in my head. So, like, every time I try to learn French, I get so incredibly confused because I'm just, like, thinking in Spanish. Like, whenever I speak... Or whenever I, like, try to speak, like, I don't know. It's just, it's so weird. I can't even describe it because I feel like nobody else's language brain works this way. And mine is just, like, overly complicated. It's just so weird. Next villager is going to be Goldie. Oh my gosh, that's such a bold assumption. But uh, it makes me feel like you're right. Let's just say hello to Goldie real fast, maybe. And Melanie, thank you so much. I have to go babysit now, but I'm sending all the Mel vibes your way. Melbo will come soon. Thank you. We will have a honky-tonky time. I appreciate it. Don't try and learn Italian then. That's like 95% Spanish. Oh my god. I really want to learn Italian, but now I'm scared. Yeah. I don't know. Okay. 62. No cap. Okay. I believe you. I believe you. And this one's Goldie, correct? We're just gonna say a quick little hello to Goldie. Oh my god, Goldie, you look a bit different than last time I saw you. This guy's name is... Show me your face. Show me, show me your face. Show me... Ew, 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 ew. I just saw his little, like, butt. Show me your face, show me your face. I forget his name. Rodney! Oh my god, I'm so mad. I knew it was Rodney. Okay, okay. Oh my god, get me out of here. I hate these little stupid uh, hamsters. I'm gonna make a guess. It'll be on 74. Okay, we've got 63, 74. I think we have a 78. Oh gosh. We're gonna get it. We're gonna get it. It's okay. Okay, I'm back. You can find Melba now. Oh, thank you. Thank you. We were waiting. So it's actually good. Yeah, now now we'll just get it easy peasy and it'll be fine. And Punky Phenicopterus. I think I said that right. Phenicopterus, thank you so much for getting a membership. Welcome to Sprigdom. I really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Hurts me that you aren't getting the bottles. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. At first I cared and then I was just like, I just want the villager, you know? It's just extra time to run. I said I would donate 500 pounds to a Walla conservation charity if you find Melba at number 69. Oh my god. That would be very generous. I I would love that. I I'm now I hope so. I'll donate money to a koala conservation charity if if we get Melba on 69. I think that would be fantastic. Charlie, I'm buying you a pack of Amiibo cards? Oh my gosh. Thank you, Action Frog. You don't have to. Oh. Oh! Yeah. Yeah. I'm hearing noises. I can't tell if somebody is, like, playing the melodica or if that's just, like, the game. I don't even know. Or I'm just losing it. I don't know. <laughs> it's like, I don't know why I hear that. Okay. It's okay. Quinoa will finally be somewhat complete after Charlie finds Melba. Quinoa is actually doing really well. It is like... I don't know. I like... I'm... It's coming to a close, I feel. We've got almost all the builds done for the villagers that we have now. I feel like all we're gonna have to do is do like the connecting kind of things. So like... <laughs> so like like in between the shop and my house like have some sort of little thing along the wall there or something i don't know i have to figure it out but it's almost done also i just like I, gungle i think i which again is a fantastic username i love that i wish i thought of that but the fire is quietly playing the melodica in the background just sent me do you still play every day i try to play every day it's I, I, I time travel now because I, literally my life has been so absolutely bonker nuts that I haven't been able to play every day. 
Oh, it's ketchup. She's so cute. Oh, she's so cute. I'm so sad. I'm, I'm so sad. I'm actually so sad. Okay, that's I'm I'm grieving for a minute. I'm just grieving. I really like ketchup and I've never had her on an island, but she's just so cute. The leaf on the head is a good sign. She is a tomato. I know she's such a cute little tomato. I just love it. Oh God. It's okay. We're fine. Maybe it's a good sign because it's like a good, a good villager. I'm kind of sad the horn boy didn't win. I forget his actual name. The horn boy. Yeah, Hornsby. We actually found Hornsby too, which is the sad part. That's the sad thing. <sighs> but it's okay. We're going to find Melba and it's going to be great. When are you going to stream Tears of the Kingdom again? Oh my gosh, I want to stream it again so freaking bad. I've been like, I'm going to be gone from the 27th until I think July 5th. I'm going to be traveling and then I'm going to be probably able to do stuff for like after July 5th until like the end of July. It's going to be a bit busy because I'm going to be packing a lot, but I don't think I'm actually moving until like the end of July, beginning of August time frame. So hopefully when I get back, <laughs> hopefully July 6th will be a Tears of the Kingdom day. <gasps> it's Vivian. Oh, not what I wanted. I really want it to be Island 69 so that we can all donate to koalas because that would be so cute and I would love that. And thank you, Falls, An Fal Falls, Fal Falls Anarchy. Oh my gosh, I read that as like one word and then it broke me. Falls Anarchy, thank you. <laughs> Melba's too busy getting high off the eucalyptus. Poor Melba. Poor, poor Melba. Melba. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're five away from the funny island number, so hopefully that's the one. But who knows? Charlie, would you ever do a day in the life video? It'd be so cute. Uh, maybe i really want to do more in real life stuff i want to do like i don't know more like cooking stuff like i was saying i don't know i it, it would feel weird for me to do like an in the life thing because first of all my life's not that exciting <laughs> and second of all like i don't know it feels like narcissistic to me where it's like do people really want to know like i literally like get up and then i like record for a while and then i make lunch and then I work more, and then I go to bed, and that's kind of it. <laughs> but maybe if I had like a particularly interesting day. I do have like a bunch of footage. Sorry, I'm just going to spin three times for luck. I do have a bunch of footage from when I went to London and met Shrek, my love. Oh my... <laughs> I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to, every time I see a gorilla, it's like a a literal punch in the face. It's like somebody punches me in the face. But yeah, I do have footage from that and I wanted to make like a little vloggy thing, like a travel vlog, because I was like, oh, that'd be cute, but I haven't gotten the time to edit it yet. And I also don't know if I want to do that on like my second channel or if I would do it on like my regular channel. You know, I don't know what the vibe is for that. But I still want to edit that because meeting Shrek was literally such a funny experience. And we're like married now, so it's it is what it is. Oh no, I knew. Ah, uh, uh, God. Oh my God. Okay, maybe an outfit change is needed. Maybe the eucalyptus isn't really doing it for me. Not really doing it. So it's gonna be okay. I took a break, and you still haven't found Melba. This game is crazy. I know. I know. I know. I know. It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. We're gonna do it. Oh, uh, Charlie, go see Lucky for luck. You're right. What was I going to dress as next? Not the, oh, like a sleepy, little sleepy gal. Because that's what Melba is, is a little sleepy gal. I thought I had like a nightgown. Maybe I don't. Uh, oh, pajamas. Perfect. Okay, and then... I need like a little, ooh, 
Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. It's all coming together. And then do I have, like, a face mask or something? No. Okay. That's fine. And then maybe we can wear just, like, our slippers. Wait. These slippers? I wish I had... Oh, whoa! I do have matching slippers. Okay. Ooh, we look so good. Okay, let me take these glasses off, though. Oh, look at that. That's like probably what Melba looks like right now. She's taking a little nappy. Just a little nappy. Okay. This is going to be good. We're going to get it. Okay. Okay. What is your opinion on zipper slash egg day? Oh, Eileen, I have good news for you. Um, you're going to find out when I post the seven month thing because I did the Easter event for the first time. And I definitely had thoughts. <laughs> oh gosh. You'll see. It's... I, I definitely do have an opinion on it. It's not... It doesn't... It's not favorable, I wouldn't say. But, you know... It is what it is. Okay. Okay. I believe. Stardew Valley flashbacks? I know. It's all the Easter events that really do it to me, I feel. Okay. Mm, I hope that Al is here. Actually. Let's see. Oh, it's it's tip tipper. Tip tipper. Oh my god, I'm so good. Oh gosh. It's like I made them myself. I know them all by heart. Except for the other ones that I didn't know. But most of them. I do know. <laughs> I miss Quinn. Oh my god, Stefan, don't say that. No. <laughs> You're- oh yeah, it's all coming together just reminding me of Kronk. I think I literally stole that from Kronk, just like point blank. Oh yeah, it's all coming together. I say a lot of Emperor's New Groove and Kronk's New Groove references and I don't know why. Like, first, I don't even watch that many movies, and then I feel like, I feel like they just, like, bleed into the things that I say. Where suddenly everything I'm saying is, like, a movie reference, and I'm like, I'm not even that kind of person. It's just that they attach to my brain. Okay. 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 We are on Island 66. Time for takeoff. And we're going. Okay. Live, love, Kronk is my motto. That's a good motto. I do like that motto. Live, love, Kronk. Kronk is like... I don't, I don't know. I feel like he's just such a good character. Like, he's just such a great little guy. I feel like he's just trying his best. Making his spinach puffs. Doing his best for Pacha. I just... I just like Kronk. Is Melba the last villager needed to complete your island? She is. She is gonna be... That could not have been more disappointing. I apologize. I really thought for some reason, I thought this like rock was Melba, but no. She is. She's going to be our final villager on Quinoa. And we're really wrapping up Quinoa. It, which is like simultaneously sad, but then also simultaneously very happy. I feel like I... I didn't intend for Quinoa to take so long, but then like my life just like for a minute like spiraled. And then it was like, oh, okay. And then it was just kind of like busy. But now, now we're really wrapping it up. Also, show us how many tickets you have left. This is how many tickets we have left. We still have a good amount. We're going to get Melba. It's just a matter of like patience, tenacity, you know, such other such traits. And we have them. So it's actually going to be fine. Okay. Okay. Time, time for takeoff. Okay. La 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 la. I really want Wart Jr. and no one understands my deep love for Mort, Wart Jr. I don't know why I said Mort. I actually saw Wart Jr. today and he was doing great. Um, I wish I could send him to you, but I think he's kind of precious. He's kind of cute. Mel, Mel bad. Yeah, Melba. More like Mel suck. Oh my god. Do five circles to the right, then five circles to the left, because Melba equal five letters in quality. Okay, okay. Gotcha. Okay. 
Vegemite, 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 Vegemite. Marmite, 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 Marmite. Okay. I actually hope it's Al. Oh, who is that? I don't even want to know. I don't even want to know. I already know. I know the face of that villager, but I don't know their name and I don't like their face. So I'm not going to say hello. Uh, okay. We are going to do it. Okay. Like, don't worry. It's going to happen. And it's going to happen on the next island. No, the one after that one, because it's the funny number. And then we're all going to donate to the koalas and they're going to live happy. And it's going to be fantastic. La 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 la. Okay. You know, I could use some Al in my life. I could use, um, I don't know. Like I said, Jambet. Jambet would work. Honestly, any of the frogs. I would like to see some of the other villagers that we had on our bracket that we didn't end up choosing. Like maybe Tad. I'd like to say hello to Tad. Um... Pippi. Pippi would be good. Like, just say hello to all the old villagers, too. Like, Pippi, Tammy P. Bear, see how she's adjusting, you know? Maybe, uh, I don't know, some other villagers. <laughs> I already saw Boots, so don't need to see him again. Kronkawalla. Kronkawalla. Oh my god. <laughs> I love Kronkawalla. I wish there was a koala named Kronkawalla, and then I could go and sit, get them instead of Melba, because she's kind of mid. <laughs> it's another bird! It's Sterling! Get out of my life! We had a like a little reprieve from all the birds, and I feel like they're coming back, and I don't like that. Faith! Oh my god, yeah! I totally forgot about Faith. It's Kronkin' time. Kronk. I don't think Kronk ever says that, but I might start saying that. It's Kronkin' time. That just bows my jangles. I like it. Also, I could talk to Lucky, but I accidentally gave him a really unfortunate catchphrase today, so I'm a little bit... Uh, I'm nervous about talking to him. <laughs> I didn't really... I wasn't really thinking. Like, I had just woken up and I was like, I don't know, it's the first thing that my brain thinks. And it was not very good. Not, like, bad, but just, like, what? You know? But it's okay. Have you planned out what you're gonna say when you see Melba? I mean, I don't really want to see Melba, but, like, if I saw her, I would probably say something like, Oh, could I might want some prawns on the bobby? Or something. And then she would be like, Oh, God, Vegemite. And I'd be like, Oh, my God. You know? Okay, but this is the island. Stafford is concerningly close to the power button of the PC. Can you please? He's scaring me. He's scaring me. Okay, I think we're chill. I think we're good. Okay. This is the island. We just got the, the luck from Clifford. Let's go. Okay. 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 Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Didn't we just see you? I'm... I'm a little pissed off. These people. Like, you want attention that bad. I just saw you. I didn't even talk to you. That's how little I wanted to see you. It's okay. It's okay. Oh, no. Oh, no. Take Claude? I do not want him. What the heck? Why would I ever? That is like the last villager that I ever, ever want. No offense to the Claude lovers out there, but... Mm. To be honest, I'm a bit relieved. Don't really have 500 pounds to spare. You know, totally understandable. I wouldn't have expected you to anyway. That was quite a high ask, but the koalas will get their money another day. Hopefully, level 70. 70. Clifford has cursed the stream because you're not paying attention to him. Clifford, duh. Clifford's being a hecker again. No, it's okay, because we'll get her on 88 and I'll give you my switch. I don't... 
No need to give me your switch. It's fine. But 88, we will keep in mind. 70? Somebody said like 74. It's Marina again? She is so annoying. I see her all the time. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wait, wait. It's gonna be 96 because she's from Australia and it's upside down. You're you're a genius. You are actually a genius. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's okay. Now we know. Now we know. I feel like that's totally it. Actually, like that was that just broke my brain. I feel Clifford, please. Clifford, stop screaming at the ants. Clifford, he's... Clifford has made friends with the ants that are in my apartment. And he gets very upset when they don't want to play with him, so he sits in the corner and screams. But, like, that's not gonna make them... They don't want that, Clifford. So stop, please. <laughs> Marina's actually really cute. I do like Marina. It's just she doesn't really fit on quinoa, and she's kind of like... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. We're holding out for, you know, Melva. Advocating for Cliffy Cam. Oh my god. I want to. He's just not that kind of cat, though. Like, he doesn't sit in one spot. And if you try to make him, then he gets... Did I change the counter? <laughs> okay, 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 okay. I don't think I changed the counter. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. That actually, that island didn't really happen because I didn't change the counter. So then I actually, like, it was, you know, the game was like, well, you didn't change the counter. So it's actually fine. So next one is going to be like back to normal business as usual. Then move the camera when he moves. Easy. Just chase your cat around the house. Like, I would have to. You don't understand. He's just not that kind of cat. Like, whenever I try and, like, lay with him, unless it's in the morning, he really likes to say hello in the morning. But whenever I try to, like, lay with him on the floor and just talk to him, he, he just walks away. I'm like, okay. Yeah, no, that's fine. Totally fine. Understandable. Okay. Okay. Ticket 73. I'll give memberships times five. Oh my gosh. Oh, we'll see, I guess. Okay. Let's see. It's gonna happen. Calm eucalyptus. Calm eucalyptus. Okay. Okay. Okay, I'm going. I'm ripping off the band-aid. Oh, I wish I could put it back on. I do not want that horse. What the frick? Okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. So you, you said 73 and I did not listen. Okay. It's okay because now it's gonna be Melba. You know? It just happens that way. Also, just... Oops. Just out of curiosity, how do you tell who's like in... Who the four villagers are that you can never ever get? Like, how... How do you do... How do you know? <laughs> Just to make sure. <laughs> no memberships? That was Island 72, technically. But that's okay. You don't have to do anything. I just appreciate your presence. I thought they were giraffes. They're horses? Yeah, they're giraffes. I don't know why. They just... Or no, they're horses. Sorry, I don't know. I'm, I'm losing it. It's so hot in this room. Okay. Okay, Charlie, you calm liftus. You're right. Thank you, Luke. This is gonna be the one because I'm you calm liftus and we're gonna be okay. Okay. I'm sleepy. I'm sleepy and I'm asleep and I I know that I'm gonna find Melba. La 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 la. 
la 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 giraffes are actually kind of cool i wish that there was a giraffe villager because i really like giraffes like they are just oh it's freaking cookie again oh my god get out of my life <gasps> a bottle giraffes are really cool though because they're like obviously very long so they need a bunch of different like i don't know their body has to compensate for their longness with a bunch of very interesting strategies like when they bend over to drink water they have these like insane like river like branched out eh like veins or whatever in their head because if they didn't then the blood would just kind of like rush to their head and it would not be a good time for the giraffe but because they have that it like goes slower and they can actually like drink water and like like lower their head i just think that's so cool and they're so i don't know they're just cute i like the way that they look they just look so disproportionate and it makes me feel like they're just adorable i just like them I like a good giraffe. The four players in your moving queue come from other players who you've played with or interacted with? Oh, I don't know. Huh. Clifford! How did you even get in here? What the heck? I really thought, like, I thought he left. I don't even know how he did that. But anyway, 74 that's why gracie should be back in the game oh my gosh i totally forgot about gracie i actually loved gracie and i kind of wish that she had more designs in her store she always just had that like weird chocolate design and like i don't know the chocolate looking furniture and i was always like you know for a really good like designer i feel like you should have more than one design okay Tianxiong, I can't. It was... Uh, okay. I was thinking in my head, I can't... I'm gonna get Melba right now, and then I'm gonna be like, oh my gosh, it's a eucalyptus island, so it totally makes sense. But no, it was just a, a monkey. But it's okay, because everybody's saying 75. 75. And you know what? I know. No. Okay. Marmite is seven letters. Melba is five letters. Thus, 75 is it, you know? The math is just, it's mathin. Clifford, stop getting suspiciously close to my PC button. I need you to stop with that behavior. No, oh my God, oh my, stop it. It's literally like he knows he like sees it shining or something and he like swats he's like trying to turn the PC off Clifford this is very like unhelpful we're trying to find Melba do you know Melba are you friends here let me Clifford any words oh my god here birds Okay, I scared him with the microphone. He, he did not have words to say. Sing, Charlie, sing? I don't have anything to sing. We're not at that level of, of the insanity yet. But it's okay. 75? Everyone's saying 75, so I feel like maybe this is the one with Al. I'm just gonna walk up confident like I, I know it already. <gasps> oh... It's Prince. I don't understand the character design on Prince, but I'm still a little sad because he kind of vaguely re resembles Tad. And it just makes me think of what could have been. Even though we still would be searching even if it was Tad, but you know. It's the principle of the thing. Okay. Okay. Uh, anyway. <laughs> All right. And Alex, thank you so much for the super chat. Are we looking for a koala? Is my Australian energy going to help this time? Also, Marmite, only Vegemite. I just don't... I didn't know there was a difference. Oh my gosh, I forgot. I thought it was just brands. Okay, Vegemite only in this household. But thank you. The Australian vibes are strong. We've got the Mel vibes, the Australian vibes. How can we go wrong, you know? 
And I mean, it always happens like almost at the three hour mark for a stream. And we're only at two hours and 30 minutes ish, kind of. I forgot to start recording, so I don't know. Imagine if the four Q villagers were Tad, Kiki, Maple, and Melba. I literally, well, I've seen Tad before, so I know Tad isn't. But I literally don't know how to, how to see who's in my queue. Sing the Australian national anthem. Oh my God, that exists. I don't even know like my own. Okay. Uh. What the heck is this? <laughs> okay. Australians, all let us rejoice. For we are one and free. We've golden soil and wealth for toil. Our home is girt by sea. What is girt? Our land abounds in nature's gifts of beauty, rich and rare. In history's page, let every stage advance Australia fair. What is Australia fair? I, that, I don't like... I, I don't know. I don't... I, anthems, anthems, anthems. <laughs> you mean that exists all country? I don't know. I don't think about the American anthem either. I don't know. I've never heard it. I don't even know the Canadian anthem. I don't know. All I know is, oh, Canada. Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I don't know that I can't. <laughs> uh, oh, God. I don't know. No one ever sings the second and third verse. Yeah, I didn't think so. That's why I just stopped. Also because I didn't know the rhythm or the melody. So I was like, eh, <laughs> I should just <laughs> all, probably all activity. And Graceman, thank you so much. Your singing was just too beautiful. I had to. Well, thank you so much. I don't want this to be associated with our anthem. <laughs> me either, trust me. I don't know much about Australia. I made this, I made this clear. You were actually pretty close. Was I really? I feel like I was just using an alteration of O Canada, but then not really singing a note, and it I was like, you know, it's gotta be close. Do you know Genovia's national anthem? Like from the Princess Diaries? Oh thank goodness. I was like, is Genovia a real place? <laughs> I felt so bad for a minute. Oh god, okay. That would have been so bad. Okay. <gasps> no! It's another thingy. It's another horns bee. Another horn boy. Dang it. Okay. We're gonna get there. We still have time. We still have time. We still have 30... We have 30 minutes left in stream, you know? Okay. I literally... I know the Genovian national anthem a little bit. I know the like Genovia, the land I call my home. I I remember. Oh, I love the Princess Diaries. I might just watch the Princess Diaries tonight, and that's not a joke. I love those movies. I don't know why. They're just so comforting to me. I love like oh my gosh when Julie Andrews literally like, or probably a stunt double, but when she like slides down the mattress thing. Oh my god, my queen. Actually, I love her. Oh my, ever since seeing that movie where that's so Raven and like Anne Hathaway or whatever, there's mattress sliding. I'm just like, ah, how do I, how do I get, how do I put me there? How do I get there? I just loved it. I loved it. I ate it up. Oh my gosh. Julie Andrews is such a sleigh. She is. She's so cute. I love her. I want her to be my grandma. Okay, that was actually Julie Andrews sliding down. Oh my, I'm really sorry that I ever thought that. Honestly, Julie Andrews, I, if you hear this, I love you. And it's true. Ugh, it's Vivian again. We're getting so many doubles. It's killing me. J dress as Julie Andrews? What if I dress as Julie Andrews? You can't say no to the queen. You cannot, you cannot. If Melba, if I say you must come... You cannot, because I am the queen, you know? It wasn't a stunt double, it was her? That's so iconic. I actually love that. Oh my god, if Charlie finds Melba, I'll try and write a quinoa national anthem. 
I would literally love nothing more. Yes. Yeah, I maybe I'll write a national anthem. That's amazing. That's such a good idea. I should do that. Okay, let's dress as Julie Andrews. Which is better, the first movie or the second? I feel like the second movie is way better, but the first one gives context to it. And I feel like every time I watch it, it kind of like ages like a fine wine, you know? Is Charlie Canadian? Uh, like, I don't know, ha like, kind of. Not, like, kind of. <laughs> I don't live in Canada anymore, though. This doesn't look at all like what Julie Andrews wore. I don't really have a Julie Andrews dress. I'm just not as much of a queen as, as her. This is probably the closest we're going to get is this like noble dress. Oh, wait. No, that's too short. I'm trying. I want the gown. First is nostalgic. Second is iconic. That is. Yes, perfect. That is exactly how I would explain. Oh, oh my God. Call me Julie. I don't even know. It probably doesn't matter what shoes we have on. Okay, now we're Julie Andrews. Look at me. I'm the queen of Genovia. Honestly, those pajamas were already pretty close to the mattress scene. You're actually right about that. I feel like that is so valid. Also, I don't know if I changed the counter. I'm, I may I may have, but I don't, I'm just going to put it at 80 because I just don't know. Okay. No, 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 no. Oh, I hate this. I hate this. I hate this. I hate this. Oh my gosh. Also, I don't know. Is, are they ever making another Animal Crossing? Because I know... Like, I love this one. I do. But I just really want to. I want to play another Animal Crossing. And I want there to be fish villagers, you know? I don't know. I don't know if that's a thing that they're doing. Or even considering. But I would love it. Julie Andrews would pole vault across a river. Oh my god, she totally would. I love her for that. Okay. 80. 80's gotta be the ticket, right? Right. I am the queen. I am the queen. You must do it for me. Axolotl villagers or bust? Oh my god. Stop. They are like wasting so much potential by not doing aquatic animals. Like, come on now. Or I guess they do have like octopuses, but whatever. <gasps> ah! No, 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 no. How dare you? It's okay. Okay, it's going to be okay. It's really going to be okay. We're just hanging out. And that is what I value most about this experience. You know, everyone protests Nintendo until we get fish animals. I genuinely want a fish like so bad. And yeah, it is confusing that there's frog villagers, but then you can catch frogs also. Like, why did why did they do that? Like, did they not think about it? Or like, you can catch an octopus, but also you have octopus villagers. Like, does that mean that they're like a different species? Or like, I don't know. I don't know, man. My my brain's breaking and I just need Melba so bad. I guess it's a Pluto goofy situation. Yeah, you're so right. It's just one of those things where you're like, huh? Why? Pourquoi? Why have you done this? Oh my gosh. When I think of fish villagers, I think of webkins. Oh my gosh. I only had one webkins and it it, it was a turtle named Tittle. And I don't know why. But my friend gave me a turtle in like first grade for some reason. I don't even know. Like we weren't even that close. But for some reason, he just gave me this like turtle webkins. And then I, I named it. <gasps> oh, from one queen to another. I am so sorry. Oh my God. That this is so this is painful. This is that was no. That is one. I gotta just autopilot leave, or else I'm. I may just change my mind. Oh no! 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 <laughs> oh no! 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 Royalty meets royalty. I know. I know. 
I love her so much. I can't. It's the outfit. You're right. No, Charlie. No, stop. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I can't. I need... We, got, we gotta get Melba. This is the point. We need Melba. We need to stand strong. What the frink? I'm sorry. Look, I want Anka just as much as the, the next guy. But the, we need Melba. We've decided if you if you wanted Anka that bad, then you should have added her to the bracket, but you didn't. So now we have to get Melba, you know? Shame on you. I do love Anka. I do. What the Frank is also so funny. I'm going to start just saying what the Frank. I love that. I've started integrating the word interdasting into my everyday conversations and nobody understands it, but it means a lot to me. Okay, 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 okay. <sighs> okay. Were write-ins an option? I mean, I don't know. I don't know how I would have reacted in that situation. Who is this? This is Mo? Oh, God. Okay. After Anka? I'm sorry. You are no match. I don't know if Raiden's were an option. I, I'm not sure. I made the bracket like 10 minutes before I sent out the ping to everybody, so... <laughs> maybe. Okay. It's gonna be okay. We're gonna be okay. La la la. It's definitely gonna be 96. Yeah, I feel like... Like, it's... We, we're at 2 hours and 41 for my recording. I don't know how long we've actually been going. Because like I said, I goofed and didn't start it. But in my mind, we're only 20 minutes away from getting Melba. Because I'm not even kidding you. I've done like probably two or three of these villager hunt streams. And every single time, like at three minutes on the dot, we get the villager. Watch you not get Melba. Okay, Joe, watch me get Melba literally right now. Just because you said that. You know... You know, you know, you know. I think if you had allowed write-ins, you'd be stuck with Al at the end of the day. D Davis, that's exactly what I was thinking. I was like, I'm, there's no way I'm letting them choose. And then I get stuck with Al or Boots. And then I have to find them. Oh my god, screw that. No. <laughs> okay, okay. I'm back. Who won? We got Melba as our, our lovely villager that we're looking for. We're not having the best of luck, but, you know, we're going to find him. Oh, no, it's a lion. Okay, Joe, I apologize. That was my bad. <laughs> oh, no. I really thought that if I said that, then maybe I'd get Melba, but it just did not happen. But it's okay. Three minutes. Yeah, three minutes we could. It's okay. We'll get her. It's fine. Imagine hedgehog villagers. Oh my god, it would be just like Sonic. I mean, hedgehog villagers are literally the Able sisters and they do look like Sonic, so, you know. Oh, I really want bubble tea right now. It is so hot in this room. I don't know. I just want like a lovely little cup of bubble tea. And like, I don't know. In the place that I lived before this, I think they're porcupines. Oh my god, are they? I always thought they were hedgehogs. Now I feel stupid. But in the place that I lived before this, after every stream, I would go get a bubble tea. I would like walk to the store and get a bubble tea. But now I don't live in that same place and I don't have a bubble tea place around me. So instead, I just suffer every single stream <laughs> and, and think about bubble tea because my brain has like conditioned itself to crave that so i guess that's my craving every stream is uh, just bubble tea no not the birds not the birds again no oh free me oh my gosh oh my gosh it's okay i still i'm holding out hope honestly like i'm not that concerned i'm just vibing No, no, no. Melba equals infinite bubble tea. Oh my gosh. Does the new place have boba nearby? Oh, it does. Oh, indeed, it does. The good boba. I'm so excited. 
I can't wait. Oh gosh. And even just getting my own bubbles, like it was just so cool. And I went to the H Mart and they had like so many different kinds. There was like green tea. There was um there was another one, like taro, I think. They just had so many flavors, and I was like, what? Eh? And wait, what did you decide her build would be? We decided on for Melba a bed and breakfast. We're gonna do because koalas all they do is sleep and eat you know we we kind of came to that conclusion and so we're gonna make her career sleeping and eating and allowing that for other people <laughs> so <laughs> no imagine jellyfish villagers oh my gosh i can't or else i'll cry because it's not real <laughs> no the bird the birds are happening again guys it's happening again i'm scared i don't like i don't i don't Aww. it's okay it's okay i want that to be my career me too and are you gonna do an island tour i am gonna do an island tour once i finish the island for sure i'm almost done with it honestly i mean i have like uh i don't even i have the builds done for marshall fauna poppy Wolfgang and then Lolly almost. This is taking so much brain energy. So then, literally, all I have to do is like Lucky, Sherb, and uh, Melba and Doc. And I have an idea for Sherb. The other three, I'm not really sure. But then, yeah, I don't know. It's just the way it is. And then we're done, pretty much. Once I do, like, all the interconnected parts, too. It's gonna be really cool, but also a little bit heartbreaking. Because I've had so much fun playing on Quinoa, and, like... It's Marlo! Hold on, hold that thought. My man! Wasn't expecting to run into... I don't know, I can't do an Italian accent, either. <laughs> I really gave it my best shot, though. Okay, bye! Yeah, no, but, like... Yeah, I'm gonna do a new island and I'm so excited about it. But like I was saying, I really want to do... Like, I was so inspired by that, like, 30-day challenge video. Like, I think it would be so fun to just, like, post a video every day. And just, like, see how much I could do in 30 days. Like, that would be so cool. Like, what the heck? Froggy Crossing, that was such a good idea. <laughs> and now I'm inspired and I want to do it. But I can't because this island... Is just being a hecker. I'm Melba's not coming. Everything takes so long. But it's okay. He wasn't expecting you on this the day of his daughter's wedding. I know. I'm so I like I know that that's from the Godfather, but I've never watched the Godfather, and I'm I really like Zootopia, so all it makes me think of is the little rat. He's like on the day of my daughter's wedding, a skunk butt rug. <laughs> Oh my god. A butt- a, a, a rug made from the butt of a skunk. I freaking love Zootopia. Oh my gosh. I thought he was a mole? Excuse me, he is a shrew? Oh, my bad. <laughs> I thought he was like a little- like a mouse or something. Okay, maybe he's a shrew. Okay. <laughs> what are you? What are you? Get, no, get out of here. That's just another bird I do not want to see. Oh. oh my god. Oh my god. Have I ever come across Raymond on a villager hunt? I've seen Raymond... I would say probably like three or four times. Yeah, probably three or four times. And I do like Raymond, but he's just not really my vibe. He's just like one of those villagers, kind of like Anka too, or like Kabuki, where it's like, you are so cool, but I feel like you're too cool for me. Like, does that make sense? It feels like I'm, I'm not cool enough to have villagers like them. <laughs> okay, okay. Okay, does Melba's B&B &B have a name? Hmm. I don't know. I, I'm trying to like... Melba's bed and breakfast. Melba, Melba, <laughs> I don't know. I, don't, I literally don't know. 
I'll have to think on that. Because I don't think anything has a name, really. It's just like Marshall's Coffee Shop, Anna's Library, and stuff like that. Mel Bed and Breakfast. That's, that's pretty good. It's like integrated. It's cool. Is this, I keep seeing this stupid clay hamster and thinking, is that Fauna? And then I'm like, how did Fauna escape? <laughs> the heck? Oh gosh. We're getting close to 96. And you know what that means? Melba time, baby. It's going to be good. Mel B and B. That's pretty good too. I mean, what would I name the other stuff? Like what was, what would Marshall's coffee shop be named? Probably something like I don't know. Something like... Something posh, I feel. It would be like... Empty cup or something. Something like that, you know? I feel like it would be. I'm trying to think, but then at the same time, I'm just thinking, should I change my clothes? Am I making us have bad luck? I don't know. The bookend. Ooh, that's kind of cool. I kind of love that. Crispy coffee, because his catchphrase is crisp. That's cute. Okay, I kind of like crispy coffee, I feel. Angry beans? Is that just the angry bird version of a coffee shop? I kind of like crispy coffee. I don't know why. But you got Anka in this fit. Okay, that's true. That's like the ultimate luck. So I'll keep it. I'll keep it. Okay. Let us see... I don't see anybody. Oh, they're up there. Oh, he no, it's the kangaroo again. Oh my, it's okay. Just five more islands. And then we're home free. With Melba. Oh no. You guys are saying bed and Melba instead of breakfast. So you're saying Melba is the breakfast? Who's, who's making Melba? the food on this island. I would not eat Melba. Oh my gosh. That is so... Guys, come on now. Maybe that's why Melba's not coming, is because she, she senses that you're trying to eat her. I would not eat you, Melba. I would not. And that's the most important thing, is because I have the most direct access, so... You know. Time for take off. Charlie, do you play Roblox? I literally don't know what Roblox is. I think... No, like, uh, no. I don't know. <laughs> I feel like I watch people play Roblox and I try to, like, wrap my head around it, but I just don't know. Well, I don't get it. And maybe that's just a me problem. Maybe I'm too old. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh, gosh. Okay. Let's see. 91. Oh no. Oh, it's Cephalo Bird. Sprocket. Yeah, that's what I said. Uh, shoot. Zort. Okay. Well, that's kind of a cool villager, honestly. Like, I'm not, I'm not that mad about it, but I am a little mad that it's still a bird. <laughs> even, even though it's a robot, it's still technically a bird, and it does make me a little, uh, just a wee bit upset. I will not lie. But it's okay. Okay. Charlie, were you a band kid? Oh my god, yeah. But like, not like a tryhard band kid. I just like did band every year for some reason. <laughs> but yeah, I'm, I'm, uh, I've started off and I played the clarinet. And a lot of people say, you look like a clarinet player. And I'm like, okay. And then I changed to percussion because the band director was like, oh, does anybody know how to play piano? We need someone to play the xylophone for this thing. And I was like, oh, I know how to do that. And then I was like, oh, percussion's way more fun. I get to just eat snacks back here instead of like, I don't know, getting yelled at right in the front because I was like first chair or whatever. So then I switched to percussion and it was much better. <laughs> and it was very fun. You look like a clarinet player and people say, I don't know why people say that. But yeah, I really liked percussion and I, I, I think at the end of like high school, it started to be less of like, a, oh, band is fun and more like, 
I'm doing this for to look well-rounded for colleges, but you know, it was still a good time. Oh my god. I am I am that is eh, oh, I uh it's going to be okay. We're going to be okay. I mean, we only we're almost at 96. Three more islands or four, but we're almost there. It's going to be so good. La 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 la. La 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 la. I feel like most band members hated color guard. What is what is color guard? I don't know what that means. I don't know. I don't know what that means. Maybe I wasn't paying attention when they did that. <laughs> oh goodness. As a band director, I can't believe your director let you move to percussion if you were a first chair clarinet. Well, to be fair, it was in like fifth grade, so first chair did not mean that much, you know? <laughs> like, I don't know. It was like, I don't know. It was not, it was not good. Like, it wasn't high school first chair. It was middle school first chair, you feel? You don't know what color guard? Color guard is waving flags and stuff around. Oh, that sounds kind of fun flag people oh my gosh no i never did the flaggy stuff it always looked really fun though like in the memorial day parade oh my god i have literally never seen this monkey before i just have to see rocket i don't like you i don't like you i don't i don't i get away from me stop stop it's okay but yeah, I did not, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't do the flags. It looked so fun though. Maybe it's not fun. <laughs> Were you a marching band or concert band? I feel like it was the same for us. Like we had, um, it's like, I don't know. We had like regular band, but then they, we would also just be forced to do the marching band stuff. Like it, but it wasn't, we only did the Memorial Day Parade. So I don't really know if that counts. Like, I'm not sure if that is a different thing and my school just didn't do it i'm not really, i don't know but i was mostly a chorus kid like i did um i don't know i did a lot of competitive chorus stuff i was in like like two audition choirs every year and then my regular choir and then like the two special choirs that were in my school so i mostly did chorus i didn't really do band but i don't know and oh and i was in jazz band too which was a thing that my school did. I don't, I don't know. Like, it, like I say this and it sounds impressive, I feel, but I, it was just kind of like I did it. I don't know why. <laughs> like, not even that I was good at it. I just did it. Like, I feel like I was good at chorus, but band, I was not. I, they, I don't know why they let me in the jazz band. I wasn't even that good. It's Tian Sheng again. I go. I saw it already. Get out of me. Get out of my life. Charlie, please, I don't mean to spam, but please say hello, Emma. It would make my sister so happy. Hello, Emma! <laughs> Sorry, I missed it. It's Emma's birthday. Oh my gosh! Happy birthday, Emma! Thank you so much for hanging out. Oh my gosh, I really appreciate it. I hope you have a really good birthday. Thank you. So sorry I missed it. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so awesome. Eh. Okay. We're getting there. Two more islands, everybody. Why am I shocked you sang? I don't know. So you didn't do like a marching show at Friday football games and stuff? Oh, no, 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 no. I don't know. We, we didn't have that. We didn't even have cheerleaders. And then suddenly like cheerleaders appeared. But they were it was like three people. And they just kind of like danced around and like, <laughs> I don't know. It was just uh, not the not the most robust of bands <laughs> do 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 -da -da -da. i missed out oh my gosh i mean we had like i went to all the games we went i went to all the soccer games and football games and they're really fun but uh it's future <laughs> i'm gonna lose it i'm gonna lose it it's okay 96 coming up you're right you're right i can't lose it because the next one's gonna be the one. And that's totally fine. But yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the last one. I know. 
Fuchsia more like Puchia. That is like the hardest word to say, I feel. Oh gosh. Okay. 100, just saying. Cindy, don't say that. Best was when you knew the your band wasn't good, but you had to go out anyway. Oh my god, yeah. I mean, my band was as good as a band can be, I feel, but like, not like, oh, we were really good. Just like, not the band that you sit and you're like, oh my god, please make it end. But I feel like my chorus was like that, where the issue would be like, okay, we're gonna sing Waka Waka by Shakira, and we would all be like, please, please. Don't make me do that in front of all my peers. And she's like, okay, everybody, learn the dance. And you're like, please, please. I'm not even kidding you. When we did that, I went to the bathroom. I went to the bathroom for that whole performance. I was like, no way. Absolutely no way am I doing that. <gasps> no. Lyman, you were so close. You were so close. But that means that means that we're that we're getting there. It's somewhat connected. We've seen like every other koala. Is that just me that feels that way? Oh my god, we were so close. So close. So close. Oh my god. It's okay. What the frank? What the frank is right? How have we seen every other koala but Melba? I know. Hold on. Koala villagers. Let's just go through a little, a little list. Oh, actually, we haven't seen them all, but the point still stands. Alice, we have not seen. Okay, let me see. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven koalas. Oh, shoot, I wasn't really paying attention. There's <laughs> eleven koalas, and we have seen three of them okay it doesn't feel like that much when i count it out but you know it felt like a lot before <laughs> the point still stands exactly okay oh no i don't know how there's 11 koalas i like i just feel like i've never seen most of these koalas change the outfit it's luring the wrong koalas you're right i should change i'll change after this Oh, goodness. This is gonna be... It's gonna be okay. I've never seen Sydney before and she's adorable? Who's Sydney? Let me see. Uh, uh, uh. Do, 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 do. Oh, Sydney is kind of cute. I like it. I like it. I think I have a vibe that I'm gonna go for next time. I'm gonna just look... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Okay. It's okay. We're gonna be fine. We're gonna be okay. We're gonna be just fine. We're gonna be okay. It's gonna be fine. I honestly am shocked that every other villager hunt has ended at exactly three hours. And now I'm realizing um, that this is the suffering that people endure that I don't endure, you know? Become a kangaroo. I can't quite do that, but... It's okay. I have an outfit in mind. Also, Clifford was sitting literally right next to me and he just disappeared and I don't know where he went. So I... Okay. Ho hope he's not destroying something. Okay, the vibe I'm going for... Is I'm gonna do the thing where I dress just like them. And in the picture of Melba, she looks really, really cute. And she basically has that one outfit that I wear, where it's like the little... Whatchamacallit... Where? Hello? What the heck? I feel like it should be right here. I need to use all my brain cells. It's... it's... Uh... Oh, here, here. So it's something like this. And then she's got like the little hat and she looks so cute in the little straw hat. So we're going to dress like Melba. I wish we had the ears, but frankly, we don't. And I think that's honestly the best that we can do, but it's okay. We look cute. So also she'll be 
drawn to us because we look adorable. But at the same time, I think that she'll be, she'll be, it'll be the kind of thing where like with Doc, I dressed up as a bunny and then we attracted Doc because we were both bunnies and he's like, oh my gosh, I'm a bunny too. That's crazy. We should like talk because we have so much in common. And then it was like, oh, I'm actually not a bunny. Would you like to join my island? That's kind of the vibe, you know? What ticket are we on? I believe 98. I don't really know. I think I, I have the counter at 98, but I don't know if I changed it yet, but that's okay. This will work. Thank you, Laura. I needed that positivity, I feel. I think it'll work too. My guess was 76. No, they're at 98. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. We're gonna find her. Oh, not right now, though. I'm just like, I know that this is just like a panic response, but I'm just starting to think like, what happens if I don't? Like, what if I don't find her today and I run out of tickets? Then what? I do this whole charade all over again? The heck? I guess. I mean, I, I, I only have two days before I'm leaving, so I was going to use that time or try to use it wisely. But if it if it turns out that the only thing I do in that time is finding Melba, I guess that's okay, too. Okay. Okay. We're gonna do it. You are using it wisely. This is this is an investment for the island of Quinoa. It is wise. I have her amiibo? No, we can't use amiibos. We've got to just find her like, like, no, I don't know, normal in the wild. The stream can't end until you find her, so you may have to postpone your trip. Oh, goodness. We're going to find her. We're going to find her. It'll be fine. It will be fine. Also, I can't postpone the trip, which is why I'm actually going is because I got the, the dumpy cheap tickets and I can't actually change the date or refund them. So even if I wanted to, I cannot. Because, you know, going on a trip like that and then moving was not the thing I wanted. It's Cephalobot. I love Cephalobot. Okay, so we know that the outfit works. That's good. Good to see. Okay. It's gonna be okay. Gotta find her natty. Exactly. It's gotta be an, a natural encounter. Okay, the next one is a hundred. Is it the luck of a hundred at which we get dear Melba? We're gonna find her. I swear. I swear to you. Watch number 100 be Tad. Even if it was Tad, I would not take him and I would get yelled at and then it would be not my fault. Oh, hi, Clifford. <laughs> I found him. Where did you go? I talk to you and, like you're a human and you never respond and sometimes it makes me sad melba you want to live on quinoa so bad it's gonna be great i have eucalyptus eucalyptus on quinoa clifford can feel it it's gonna be melba i know clifford you're giving good luck thank you clifford any words any words of luck for me no Okay. <laughs> All right. This is a eucalyptus island. That's not Melba Clifford. <gasps> Clifford, Clifford. No, 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 no. Oh, no, no. Oh my God. <laughs> Sorry, Clifford almost turned off the whole PC, but we're okay now. So that's a kangaroo. Um... Clifford, that's you. <laughs> okay, so that's a kangaroo. 100 was not the one, but I'm thinking maybe 101 because it's kind of like a cool lucky number. Koalas were discovered in 1798. 17 plus 98 equals 115. So we're going to find her on the 115th island. That logic is so sound. I'm ready. I'm ready. Island 115, here I come. 
Clifford in a silly, goofy mood. He's always in a silly, goofy mood. He's just a silly little goof. A little goofball. Okay. I'm honestly... I feel like 115. Like, that logic is just makes too much sense, you know? Like, it's gotta be that. Do, do, do. I assumed this was Clifford's favorite villager. <laughs> Rushing to show... No. Clifford does not like a kangaroo as his favorite villager. I do not believe. If there was an ant villager, maybe. But no. Oh, goodness. Guys, it turns out koalas love to eat quinoa. Is that true? Canonically, is Melba going to be the downfall of our island? She just eats it. Maybe it's good that she's not here. Oh my god. La da da da. La da da da. It's gonna be okay. We're gonna find it and then I'm gonna make bubble tea and it's gonna be great. I trusted the autofill for one of my plots and it gave me Shino. Oh my gosh. That's actually so good. <laughs> Wait, that's so... Like, that's never happened to me in an autofill, I'm just gonna say. Every time it autofills, I get, like, Tammy P-Bear or something. Or Flora the Flamingo. And I'm just like, okay. Why have you done this? I was actually pretty close to putting Shino on the bracket, too. But... It, it, like, Shino kind of falls into that category that I was talking about earlier. Of villagers that are just too cool for me. Like, I'm not cool enough to have them on my island, you know? Villagers that intimidate me. <laughs> But yeah. I'm excited to be able to say I was there when they found Melba. Oh, me too. Me too. It's gonna be good. I let a plot autofill and got punchy. Oh my gosh. I can't imagine. Maybe, what, what if I autofilled and it gave us Melba? That would be bonker nuts. Which villager are you replacing? I'm replacing Tammy P. Bear. I just got rid of her this morning and I was so, so excited. That is literally like the first horse that we got, I'm pretty sure. Or it had the same hair. La 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 la. La 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 la. We talked about Taco Bell in Melba earlier, so I'm eating tacos for dinner just for you. Oh, I wish I had a taco. That sounds so good. I feel like that's, that's a good dinner. That's a good Melba related dinner. Oh my gosh. Melba hunt is definitely easier on our brains compared to the dog hunt, I think. It definitely it does not... It, like, I don't know. I wasn't in a wacky mood today. Like, I literally drove... I don't even know. Like, 30 hours within a couple days. Probably more than... Actually, definitely more than 30 hours within just a couple days. So I don't have, like... I'm not on that edge of, like, sanity and chaos. I'm just like tired <laughs> in like a very heady way i just got melba in my campsite give her back is that why she's not here oh my gosh oh my gosh charlie doesn't seem to have lost it yeah no i'm here i'm here i'm level i'm only slightly like off the edge Ah! Uh, no! Whoa! What the heck? What are you? <gasps> oh my god, it's a clown sheep? Ew. Honk honk? What? <laughs> what kind of catchphrase is honk honk? I'm gonna make someone on Quinoa's catchphrase honk honk. I think that's absolutely hilarious. Goodbye. Pietro. Pride clown. Oh my god, you're right. I could have done Pietro. But yeah, not now it's not intentional, and now he's just like honk honking, and he's kind of ruining my life, so. We got clowned, literally. I know. Gosh, Pietro. Dang it. Okay, okay. We've got this. We've got this, you know? Have you ever looked at the pencils in the on the desk of the Dodo Airlines? Why do they have red, green, and blue? That doesn't seem super helpful. 
Like, why would you have colored pencils in the cup at your desk? I don't understand that. Maybe I'm just a hater. La 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 la. Pietro, honestly, a good sign in my opinion. Okay. Okay. Also, they're in the most dangerous position. I know. It's like facing upward. You could stab a person. Please do not. Orville likes coloring. Oh, that's so cute. I can't imagine him coloring. That That is kind of precious. Tipper. Tipper, nobody asked you to be here. Why? Why, 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 why? Okay. Okay, doke. Counter. 105. La 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 la. I wish we could upgrade the airport. I'm so tired of the dialogue. Like, it's so annoying to have to click through everything every single time. It's just, it's just too much. But it's okay. We're gonna get there. I have stamina. I'm ready. I'm honestly, I'm in it for the long haul. Until I run out of tickets. And you know, if I had more tickets in my storage, I would use them, but I don't think I do. So, until I run out of tickets, I'm here. And if I don't get it, I'll be back tomorrow, baby. Bright and early tomorrow morning, and I'll be going all day until I get Melba. Because that is just the kind of person I am. Ticket check? I should do a ticket check. I'll see. After this island, I will see. We're gonna be okay, though. We're just chilling, and that's great. You're still alive? Yes. Unfortunately. Oh, no. Not the anteater. It's just even worse. Like, my three least favorite things in this game are anteaters. Okay, four least favorite things in this game. Anteaters. Gorillas. Neon villagers. I forgot the fourth thing. I literally said four things just so I could say that thing and I totally forgot what it was. What is the fourth? Oh, that hamster. Clay. That thing. Those are the four things I hate most. So when I don't get Melba and then instead I get one of those four things, it just makes it worse, you know? It just, it's like salt on the wound. My wound is salted, and I am not happy. And the snooty ones, and the mice. Yeah, okay, maybe I have a couple more that I don't like, but it's okay. Give us an inspirational speech. You know... Follow your dreams. And if your dreams seem unachievable, then keep following them. Because the only thing you can do in this life is follow until you learn to lead. And thus, with my leadership, I take us to the island that Melba is at. Right here. No! Frick, it's Custo. Custo. Dang it. That was a little inspirational, I feel. I don't know. <laughs> Quote of the year. I don't know. I just... I just... I just don't know. It was the first thing that came to my head. I can- I can say another speech. Um... Once I change this. Koalas. We all love them, you know? Oh, wait. Ticket check? Oh god. We only have 60 tickets left? We have just enough to get to like... 169. So I guess that'll be the stopping point if we don't get if we don't get it. Koalas. Shiitakes. That's not what I freaking wanted to click, Orville. I'm gonna kill you. Just kidding, I wouldn't do that. Don't Wilbur, you didn't hear a thing. Wilbur, please. <laughs> okay. Koalas. We all love them. You know, I think that at the end of the day, koalas don't get enough love. I have so many friends that say they don't love koalas. They say that they're gross. They say that they're lazy. They say that all they do is sleep and eat. But at the end of the day, what do you do? Sleep and eat. That is the, the that is what it means to be a creature, to be a human being. So who why would you hate on the most purest of 
purest of beings, the koala, which performs those basal functions better than anybody. That is why I value koalas and why I want one on my island. I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Okay. You should write a haiku. I'll write a koala haiku. Okay. Maybe. One, two, three, four. Who are these people? Name and shame. <laughs> yeah. I would say their name, but then they would know who they are and they would know that I was shaming them. <laughs> okay. So we are going to write a haiku. What, what do we say? Koalas are just the darndest. That's the first line. Koalas are just the darndest. All they do is eat and sleep. But gosh, ain't it great. Look at that. That just flowed out of me like a piece of water. I can't believe that. Bars. Oh my god. Okay, I'm writing another one. I want this... No, I want this... I can't count. I want this koala. Dad. Oh, baby. Yes, I do want it. Please, Melba, can you appear? Okay, that's pretty good. It's five syllables, not five words. Oh, crud. I totally forgot about that. I forgot it was syllables. <laughs> what kind of idiot? Oh my god. I haven't been in school for so long. Oh. It's gonna be okay. Okay. Let's play a game where. <laughs> I'm, using, I'm gonna have maple here just for luck i don't know why <laughs> i don't i don't like this plane anymore <laughs> i'm gonna replace it with maple <laughs> oh, okay i don't even know if i changed the ticket number whoops my bad i think i did i don't remember okay use nook mile maple the best plane exactly let me just... Eh. Okay, okay. I'm trying to make maple wide. It won't let me. Oh, crud. Oh, oh, darn. Oh, darn, 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 darn. Please. I can't make maple wide, so I guess this is just how it is. Okay. This is the game plan. This is Melba. Oh, I'm just a koala. This is me. Oh my god. Whoa, it's the koala. Okay. Now, good. Glad that we, now that we've, now that we've established that. Now let's just reenact that real quick. Okay. <laughs> Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. It's okay. That wasn't- it wasn't meant to be, you know? Maybe that wasn't the story. Maybe- maybe life isn't about determinism. Maybe it's about letting things happen in the way that they're gonna happen. Melba is a koala bear and Maple is a regular bear. There's some relation there. This is true. This is true. I think that there is- oh, one, one, one. Somebody said that that was their- their island number. So maybe the next one is Melba. I think that that makes sense to me. 111 is kind of cool. It's like, uh, I don't know, a cool number. My favorite number is 11. I feel like that's, I don't know. It feels like everybody's favorite number is 11. Is that just me? I really like 11. I don't really know why. I think it's because it was my first basketball number. <laughs> Okay. La da da da. This is it. <laughs> this is it. Gonna have to go because I'm going insane, but best of luck, Charlie. That's totally understandable. Thank you for hanging out. Much appreciated. I wish that I could do that. Okay. Oh, it's Jambit! Oh my god, sup! 
Oh, that was not what I wanted at all. But some, for some reason, I started off hating Jambet and then kind of it became a love-hate relationship where I was like, I hate her because she looks a little funny, but then I, I love that she looks that way. You know? I'm a big Jambet fan. Okay, um... <laughs> yeah, we did not hit the nail on the head with that one. I'm just gonna come out and say that. But it's okay. We've still got time. We've still got tickets. It has been a long, long, long time, but I'm here. I'm ready. And it's good. Love to hate her. Exactly. Exactly. Also, bug villagers. I want like a... I want like a bug life. I want the ant. What's his name? I almost said Philbo. It is not Philbo. Dot? No. Remy? No. What is his name? The, like, ant in A Bug's Life who's like, oh, Flick! <laughs> yeah, Flick! Yeah, I really want- I, I feel like if we had, like, a an ant villager named Flick, if we had, um, like, a dragonfly villager would be kind of dope, maybe? That might look creepy. I think a butterfly villager could be cool. I don't know. When? If you show your face again, I am seriously going to lose it, and that's a guarantee. You need to stop. You need to stop. Okay. Ooh, a hummingbird villager. Oh, that would be so cute. I really like the idea of a hummingbird villager. Oh, wait. Isn't 115, like, the one that is definitely going to have Melba because of, like, the year koalas were founded or whatever? Bug villagers would send Blathers into a coma. Oh my god, you're so right. I forgot about that. Sorry, Blathers. But fish villagers. I'm saying it. I want a fish villager. Or I think dinosaur villagers could be so cool. If you could have... Like, I just feel like there's so much potential for good villagers. And I don't know. Like, I don't know how many villagers they actually add in each update of like the game like each new game like i don't know what the procedure is for adding new species and stuff like that but i really feel like there's a lot of potential there oh my god there was my bracelet just tickled my arm and i thought it was a like tarantula i almost cried okay we're good though okay that's this is a bird there's so many birds today what the heck? If there were dino villagers, I would immediately go get Animal Crossing. The oh, that's what I'm saying. Crud. No, the dino villagers would be so sick. You could have like, you could have a Nessie. You could have like the little Jeremiah guy. You could have, you could have a prehistoric fish. You could have, there's just a lot of options. You could have a Dunklesaurus villager. I like that. I'm getting impatient. Trust me. Me too. But it's okay. 115's gonna be the one, I feel. I feel it in my bones. Okay. Nook Mile, take... Need a dragon villager? There actually is a dragon villager, technically, I think. I don't remember their name. I think it's like Drago, Drago or Dra Dra Draco or something. But it's like uh, technically an alligator. But it looks like a dragon. Which I think is so cool. I was like looking at that this morning and I was just thinking... I don't know. Drago. Yeah, Drago. Drago. I don't know. I was just thinking there's another villager that kind of falls into the category of you're too cool for me. But also like what village theme would you fit into? Like you're just too cool to fit a theme, you know? No, it's the guy again. The bird is screaming. Ferret villager? Oh my gosh. I cannot imagine. That would be kind of funny though. Fox villagers would be cute. Oh my gosh, you're so right. Wait, a fox villager. That is actually such a good idea. I feel like I need to send a list. I need to send a list to Nintendo. 
I think I need to say you need fish. You need foxes. Like, hello? How have you not made a fox villager? What the heck? Gosh, isn't Chief basically a fox though? Oh, that's that's a that's a good point. I didn't really think of that. Okay. I really hope that I find Al on this island. I tell ya. Wolfgang is fox? I'm pretty sure that Wolfgang Wolfgang is a wolf, but I might be mistaken. <laughs> I don't really know. Okay, it's Al time, baby. This is the one. I feel it. We're gonna see Al. Please be Al. Please be Al. <laughs> it's called reverse cycle Why do you do this? Why do you do this? It's torture. It's torture. It's torture. It's torture. <laughs> It's torture. It's torture. You, what, I, okay. I'm never saying that again. That was too close. That was too close for comfort. He's here. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. The, the first zoo with koalas was in 1925. 19 plus 25 equals 44. 44 plus 44 equals 88. 88 plus 44 equals 132. Thus, island 132. She will be there. Yeah, that like kind of tracks for me. I don't know if I changed this yet. I'm just gonna change it. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Life finds a way. It truly does. Wait, you gotta go to and leave an island to unlock Melba on the following one? What does that mean? I don't even know. Melba from Animal Crossing. Welcome to the chat. Where the frick are you? Where the frink are you? Can you like appear? I'll be there on Island 420. Melba, I don't have that many tickets. I swear. Oh my gosh. Okay. I vote for an axolotl. Mm, true. I forgot about that. The axolotl villager is... Oh, it's Dizzy. No. Tip... I don't... I don't. <laughs> it's whatever his name is. <laughs> oh gosh. It's gonna be okay. Every little thing. Axel, that's the name. My bad. My bad. It's so bad. Salamanders. Oh, that's such a cute idea for a villager. What the heck? I love all of these. Like they, they need to update it, honestly. What what is this chicken business? You think I want a chicken? No. And a capybara villager would also be cute. I'm on board with the capybara villager. Oh my gosh, how many tickets do I haste? We have... We have, like... Uh... I think, like, uh, probably 50 tickets at this point left. We only have enough to get to 167, and then I'm gonna buy two to get to 169. And if we don't get it at that point... Then I'm going to take a little nappy and return tomorrow. Or it depends how I'm feeling. I don't know. We'll see. I'm wearing an Animal Crossing shirt now. Melba's coming. Thank you. I appreciate it. A koala's lifespan is 13 to 18 years. If you combine the numbers, you get 1318. If you remove the second one, you get 138. So we will find Melba on the 138th island. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that makes sense. That makes sense. Cephalobot again. Oh my god. No, no, no. This is horrific. I cannot believe this. I cannot believe this. Okay. We're gonna be okay. I was not expecting this, honestly. I'm I know this sounds bad, but like. Every other villager hunt that I've done, I've gotten the villager I wanted within three hours max. So I'm a little confusion as to why <laughs> it's taking longer. Outfit change? I could do an outfit change. Oh, good that. Okay. Let's see. I want to fly. 
I, okay. Like, this would be so much easier if I just didn't have to click through this dialogue. And I know I've said that twice, but it's just true. La la la. La da da da. Da da da. Da 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 da. I can't believe I've been sitting in a chair for four hours. This is the highest low in my life. Four hours is the longest time you've sat in a chair? My life is very sad then. There's some hours, there's some days where I just sit in this chair and record one thing for three hours and then like get up and get water and then record <laughs> for another like four hours. So, you know, I've had days that were longer, I would say. Oh, it's freaking Pietro. I got clowned again. You cannot clown me twice. Oh my god, it's like an Animal Crossing Rick roll. It, it hurts. It, it hurts. It's a physical reaction inside me. Oh my gosh. Honk honk. Don't even say those words. Now I'm the clown. Honk honk. Look at me. I am foolish. I cannot find my koala. This is just, this is just <laughs> clown me once. Shame on you. I know, I know. I got clowned twice. It's gonna be okay, though. Yeah, oh yeah, we can do an outfit change next time. I don't know what to do. I could do the slug fit. I don't know if that would help. Charlie, I got you amiibo cards. Oh my gosh! Who did- who did- wanna know who I got? What did, who did you get? Oh my god, wait. Charlie, if you change into the hot dog outfit, I will appear on Island 124. Or 123. Okay, Melba? Melba, I got you. I'll be the wiener. For you. It's gonna be there. Don't do the grape outfit. Koalas can't eat grapes. Okay, I wouldn't. I would never. I would never. That's not my goal here. It's to kill Melba. My goal is to find Melba. And make her happy for the rest of her days. If I find this squirrel one more time, I'm going to lose my mind. I am going to lose my mind. <laughs> okay. I'm putting the wiener on, so it'll be fine. We'll get her soon. 121! Making my way uh, to the island with my wiener. No. Dressed like a wiener. Ignore that. Ignore that. I wasn't thinking. I wasn't thinking. Okay, honey, your mind is already lost. You may be trying. You may be right. You may be right. Okay. Okay, let's get wienered up. And then let's check in the next two islands. And if it's not Melba, then we can do the grape outfit. Okay, where's the wiener fit? Wiener, wiener, chicken diener. Wiener, 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 wiener? Wait, wiener? Wait, what? Oh, okay. There's the top of the wiener. <laughs> I freaking love this outfit. What the heck? This is too good. I actually, this is like my favorite outfit ever, I think. Have you considered just Nike Pros? Oh my gosh, you're right. My Zelda fit of choice. Maybe I'll just go without any clothes. Maybe the clothes are distracting. Where's my wiener? I don't... What the frick? Does anybody... Hello? What? I'm going slow. I don't see it. I see my sushi costume. What? Where's my... Where? Where? What? Wait, did I lose it? What the heck? Did I ever have it? Wait, huh? Uh... Every time you don't tab through the top, it drives me crazy. Oh my god, I didn't even know you could do that. I'm not even kidding. Okay. Where's the wiener? Maybe I have it in a wand? Why would I do that? Why would I ever do that? What the heck? I don't want to get a wand. Okay. 
let me just we'll do the grape outfit we'll do the wiener next i don't have my wand on me so this is gonna be the best that i can do is this the grape outfit i totally forget uh okay tops but wow this is fantastic i didn't even know that was a thing okay this and then where's my grape hat what the what the nut all my stuff is in a wand that's so annoying okay i'm gonna be a little ant instead okay we've pivoted a lot from our original vision for this but i honestly think that this is good look at us we're just a little ant yay i like the way i like the way that the oh everything is in the wand check from the wardrobe edit wand outfit oh crud okay we'll do i'll do that later i feel i have a good feeling about this little ant outfit is that just me clifford's favorite oh my god you're so right clifford actually loves oh god i'm gonna clifford actually loves ants and it makes me so happy it like makes it alleviates the pain of having ants that are just constantly in my apartment you know and i hope i say this right lorenia i hope lorenia uh, thank you so much for being a member for one month of how you keep your spirits up during this long journey thank you it means a lot <laughs> but we're gonna do it we're gonna get melba and thank you again i really appreciate the support we're gonna do it for sure melba needs to show up i agree beware of ants living in your electronics they will do that do they do that oh that's too bad yeah i don't know it kind of makes it like before it would be like oh there's ants in my house that's so gross but now ugh. but now it's oh he's kind of cute though but now it's more of like a, oh clifford's playing with his friends you know so it's it, it hurts less it's less like ew there's ants in my apartment and more like oh <laughs> But it's gonna be good. We are gonna do it because we're dressed like an ant. And when you're an ant, you can literally do anything. I'm not even kidding you. Espionage. Ant. You are so small. Have you seen Ant-Man? Watch Ant-Man. You can like shrink down to the size of an ant and literally do anything you want. And what I want to do is find Melba. So that is why I'm an ant. In essence, you know? I feel like that logic is sound. Now that I'm an ant, it's all gonna be good. We're all gonna be okay. What if Clifford thinks the ants are mini Cliffords? That would be so sad. He doesn't like... He doesn't even try to eat them or anything. He just tries to like play with them. And I think he mostly likes really fast bugs like, uh, like, uh, flies. Like he really loves flies. But the ants, he just wants them to move faster, so he'll, like, tap them. Eh. No, 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 no! Get out of my life! I hate this game! I'm gonna cry! I'm not an ant anymore! Get me out of here! <laughs> okay. Guys, that was really scary. That was really scary. I didn't like that at all. Okay. It's gonna be okay. But now I'm thinking it's- next one is 123. It's Island 123, which means we have to be the wiener to get Melba. And also this, this outfit is now cursed. Beyond curse. Okay, so we'll see. Edit wand outfits. Oh. <gasps> wiener! Wait. This is the wrong wiener. Isn't it? Oh, that's my grape outfit. Oh, it's all coming back to me now. 
I'm gonna be a grub. Oh no, that means I. Ugh. Wait, okay, that means I have to go get my wand. Hold on. Okay. Everybody, close your eyes. <laughs> close your eyes. Close your eyes. This is spoilers. Don't look. Close your eyes. Honor system. Close your eyes. I'm almost there. Okay, you can open your eyes now. <laughs> Okay. Charlie Wiener Barley. You're so right. I can't wait to be a wiener again. Okay, let's get my wand out. I don't know. Oh, is this it? I don't know what category a wand is. Because I think I put it in here, but I literally don't know where it is. It feels like it would be down here. Like where all my watering cans are? Hello? Hello? Testing, testing, where the heck? Uh, I know it's here. Oh, there it is. There it is. Okay. I was like, I can sense it. I don't see it, but I can sense it. Okay. Now we have the wand. So let us see. We will grab the wand. And I'm gonna be my wiener. Except, oh, wait. Oh, crud. Wait, okay. No, this is fine. I was gonna be the wiener head, too. Oh, close your eyes. But I could edit the wand outfit, but I just don't feel like it. So I'll just wear this wiener outfit. I think it'll work. It's still a wiener. Fix the hat. Okay, fine. <laughs> Okay, let's see. Edit wand outfits. Oh my good lord above. Okay, revert. And also we need to take this outfit off because it's cursed, cursed, cursed. If it's underneath our wand outfit, it's not going to change anything. Okay, I'm naked. Under this. Perfect. Now, edit. I need my wiener head. Hot dog. Swap clothes. Okay. Oh, okay. I'm learning. I'm learning. I'm using the top thing. Okay, we gotta do this one. It doesn't really fit that well, but I, I could have sworn I had a better wiener outfit. I literally don't know where it went, but it's okay. I'll wear this. And then these. Wiener! Okay, perfect. Now... Oops. Okay, now. Island 123. And we have wienered up. Which means that Melba will be here. It's gonna be okay. I mean, look on the bright side. At least we know Al is not in your move-in queue. I don't even know what a move-in queue is at this point. But, I mean... He can actually... Oh, wait, I just put the pieces together. Is it, the, is it the people that are, like, assigned to, like, move into your house if you if it's, like, an autofill? And, like, you can't find them if they're in the queue or something? That would be so terrible. Yes? Oh! I figured it out. Woony! Oh... Okay, <laughs> well, hopefully Melba's not there. That'll be kind of annoying and bad. How do you even know? Is it just a matter of like... I don't know. Trying? Okay. I'm here. No! Melba, you lied to me! Who is this? Who is this? Sally? What the heck? Oh my god, I was lied to. But it's okay, because I have the wiener fit now. So we're definitely going to be the wiener. Okay. It's 9pm. This... I don't even... This time isn't even accurate. Like, on the Switch. I've been time traveling, so I don't even know. <laughs> I said the ant outfit messes it up. Oh my god. Melba, please. Do another reenactment. Yeah, maybe that was the problem. Okay. 
We'll go over the game plan. Okay, okay. 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 So, okay, game plan. This is me. This is Melba. Okay, this is me zooming in. Now, Wilbur's saying all his bubbluey. And then I'm like, oh, I really hope I find Melba. Oh my gosh! Oh my god, no way! Ah, Melba! Good eye, might. Oh my god! This is crazy! Okay, so now we just need to do that in real life, you know? Should have gone for Hornsby. <laughs> no. No, 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 no. This is okay. We're okay. I had so much hope. And I actually do like little Joey. Kind of cute. But you're not Melba. You see, the thing too is like, if it's a good villager, it lessens the blow. Like if I find a good villager, I'm like, oh, I really like that villager. But then if it's like, ow, then I'm like, Ugh. no, 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 no. So that was okay. I think that was okay. 125 still going strong the ducks are cute i know we found um we found scoot we have bill who's very cute joey little cutie i think all the ducks are pretty pretty precious i like a lot of the frogs too i feel like they're pretty solid yeah like the wolves the ducks the frogs the cats i feel like a lot of them are good but I don't know, it's kind of hit or miss. Have you found Al yet? Unfortunately, Celeste, yes, we have. And it was a horrible experience. <laughs> okay. 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 Oh no, we've seen that bird before. No, no, no! Okay. You know, I think the problem is that we care too much. Let's just have a chat about, like, anything else on this earth. And, and we'll just, like, pretend we don't care. Like, we're just playing a game, you know? It's just happening. And then, yeah. And then we'll be like, oh, that's cool. But it's like, we don't really care, you know? Okay. So... How's life? I don't know. I'm trying to think about what I'm going to eat for dinner, and I just simply don't know. I really want to make bubble tea, but now I feel like it's too late because it's, it's such a process. But I don't know. It's going to be okay. Chicken nuggets. Oh. I heard the next Spider-Verse movie might not be for a few years. Good. I want them... I want it to be like a... Zelda thing where it's like, okay, delay it and just make it like the best it could ever be, you know? I feel like I don't even care. Hashtag Melba vibes. What time is it for you? 9.04. It is 9.04 p.m. And we have not found Melba, but that's okay. It's, uh, I don't know. What is everybody's favorite color? Mine's not purple. I feel like I like the idea of having your favorite color be co colorful. Like having your favorite color be rainbow. You know? Blue? Hmm. Purple slaps? Yeah, it was just that kangaroo that kind of turned me up. Blue? Wow, everybody loves blue. Colorful. David, you and me. <laughs> Everybody likes blue. Why is blue the most, like, universally loved color? Like, I'd really love to know. If anybody has any idea. It just feels like people are conditioned to love the color blue, and I don't get why. Like, not that I hate it, because it's my favorite color, but... I don't know. Yusha, I'm not sorry. Oh my god, Karina, how could you? 
Hmm, the color of sky and water. That's true. But like green is the color of trees. I don't really know. I feel like also there's like different shades of colors too, which makes it even harder because there's like, I don't know. There's green, but then there's like avocado and then there's like, and then there's like seafoam green and then there's like turquoise. And it's like, what do you have to have a favorite shade? Do you have to have a favorite shade too? Or can, do you, can you just say blue? Cause I feel like that's not specific enough. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Now I'm just thinking, I'm thinking too many thoughts. Then there's shiny Espeon green. Oh my God. Shiny Espeon is a whole different kind of green. I swear. That thing is like ugly, but then at the same time, it's like, yay, shiny. But then it's like, ugh. <laughs> Coral and sage and lavender. That's such like a nice palette. I like that a lot. I don't know. Blue does present this calming and tranquil sensation. That's what I was thinking too. It's like, aren't a lot of social media websites like blue? because it's supposed to be calming and makes you happy or something. I don't, I don't really know. <laughs> it's, it's interesting. The psychology of color. Maybe June from Sunhaven was right. I can't change my name for 10 days. I'm so sorry. Your name is Melba needs to show up now. <laughs> oh my God. That's actually so funny. I really apologize. E no. Oh my gosh. Blue like the ocean. The ocean is large and vast. Islands are in the middle of the ocean. Australia. Oh my gosh, you're so right. But yeah, I think um I don't know. The ocean is scary. Is that just me that thinks the ocean is very scary? Like I don't I don't know there's those videos where it talks about the different layers of the ocean and like the different animals and stuff and then there's just the fact that I don't know I don't like it and I don't like swimming in the ocean and then you feel something on your foot and it's really just a piece of seaweed but I'm like nope that this is the end it's the Loch Ness monster and I'm dead now even though the Loch Ness monster is in a lock and not the ocean don't I don't want to speak of it <laughs> The ocean is just like hecka scary. That's like my biggest fear, I feel, is the ocean and the sharks inside of it. It's too big and gross. So true. Do 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 do. Do you have th thesalophobia? Uh, sa oh, salophobia? Thalassophobia. Intense fear of deep bodies of water. <laughs> yeah, I have that. I don't like that. <laughs> Oh my god, even just the picture on that, I'm like, <laughs> Jeebus, that is horrible. Oh my gosh. It's a money island, but I cannot be, I cannot be bothered. I, oh my god, why did I think that was Melba? Oh my god, I literally thought that was Melba. And I just simply don't know why. Okay, I should probably get the money. Uh, mm, okay, fine, I'll get the money. Then you remember only 2% of the ocean has been discovered. Yeah, like, what the heck? What the frick? Sometimes I think it's crazy. Like, I like I don't mean to be having, like, this 3 a.m. philosophical discussion, but, like, it's so crazy to me that, like, humans think they're such big cheese. Like, they think they're the, the, the thing. But then it's like, no. Like, you are such a speck. Like, no offense. I love you all, but you're all specks. We're all specks. It's like, if you learn in biology, like all of the different eras and stuff and you just see like how long life has been happening and how like you're only like the smallest percent of it it just really makes you feel small like a speck of dust and then like even on our own earth in the time where we're existing like we we the ocean will eat you oh my gosh okay we know more about space than the ocean. I'm kind of scared of space, too. I don't like space. 
take the 99k out of your wallet first wait stop can you just take it does that like fix this issue oh my god am i dumb and i've been dumb this whole time and i just didn't know oh my god i am dumb what the heck thank you are you afraid of deep pools i'm not afraid of deep pools because i know there's not sharks in them but i'm afraid of the ocean which i guess is just a pretty deep pool <laughs> oh goodness yeah i don't know i feel like if somebody offered to get let me go to space i would say no like i don't know if that's just me like if they said we can bring you to space and you'll i don't know you'll be in space and it'll be cool i would say no i'd be like no thank you very much i appreciate it but i do not want to go i have a fear of tsunamis i i don't know why but as a kid like everybody else like i don't know i feel like they had very normal like youtube interests and things that they watched as a kid but for me the only thing i watched on youtube growing up was like these videos of weird fish that were discovered after tsunamis and like it's just these like blob fish and stuff and like all these weird things that have come from like the bottom of the ocean and for some reason that was like the only thing i watched on youtube until i was like 12 years old and i simply don't know why i was just like ooh, cool fish okay it gives me chills just thinking about it yeah i can't think about space very long it makes me sad i don't want i don't want i don't want caution tape and i'm going around okay let's see i think i'm on 130 we're gonna know once we get to the last ticket if we do which hopefully we don't but if we do we're gonna know if i messed up or not <laughs> La, la, la. who is your least favorite villager on your island i think that my least favorite villager is probably fauna like of all the villagers that i have right now and i keep going and i keep like having these doubts where i'm like should i just get rid of fauna but then i'm like no i like fauna and she's cute and she like fits into the island so i probably won't get rid of her but i'd say that like she's my least favorite out of everybody else like wolfgang and lucky like i'm absolutely in love with i love them 100 percent. like uh doc love 100 percent. sherb super super cute i didn't expect to love him as much as i do and then like marshall also the same deal but you know yeah no i loved fauna when i first got the name but the game but now she's so mid yeah that's the same kind of deal that i had it's like at first she's really cute and then she just kind of says the same stuff and i'm like mm. fauna 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 he hello what please be melba oh my god gwen leave leave me leave leave no i will not be dishing anything get away from me yeah 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 I got Marshall on my third ticket and he's my dreamy. I got Marshall as my first campsite villager and everyone was like, oh, no way. Oh my gosh, you're so lucky. I didn't even like know who Marshall was. <laughs> I was just excited, I feel. Charlie, you're still streaming? Unfortunately, yes. Oh, it's okay though. It'll be okay. I mean, let's look at how many tickets we have left. We have 38. Okay, I obviously did not do the counter correctly, or we have exactly 169 tickets, which is kind of incredible. But yeah, I'm gonna do until I have the end of free Charlie 2023. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Me as well. I would like to be free. I'm hungry. But it's okay. I'm gonna get... Yeah, I'm gonna do the rest of the tickets. And then... If we don't get Melba... And I'm going to do it again tomorrow because I need to eat. And also, I need to get more tickets from like a treasure island thing because I'm a, I'm a dirty cheater now. Oh gosh. I hope it doesn't come to that though. I really wanted this to be like a one time, one day affair. 
I don't want the money. I just want the Melba. Not another bird. Okay, I'm not getting the money. I don't care. I don't care. I just want the the the, the koala. La da 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 da. One thirty-two. One thirty-two. Okay, everybody, send out your Melba vibes. La da da da. And Melanie, thank you so much. Have we dressed as Steve Irwin? Maybe tra channeling his spirit will help us in our koala search. Can I read? Um, we did dress as Steve Irwin on two occasions, I believe. On the first one, th I think that was literally our first outfit. We started it off hot. And then we got back to it, like, somewhere in the middle. And then, yeah. It did not work. Okay. I am here and my name has Mel in it too, so I'll manifest it. Yes, all the Mel's. Everybody. Every Mel in the world, please, Melba. With the blessing of Bob Cobb, Melba will show themselves to right. Scrap Tinker, thank you. Mel, 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 Mel. Clifford wants to leave, but I cannot let you out. Melba, Melba, Melba. Okay. Okay. We're okay. Clifford, now that you're here, I, it was because you were at the door screaming. So the gorilla came because you weren't here to stop them. I know. Yeah, exactly. So now you're gonna make it happen. Exactly. Thank you. I know. I don't know if you can hear Clifford. He's like, he's speaking. Thank you for that. Okay. 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 You ready, Clifford? You ready, Keefy? Island 133, that's gonna be it. We cannot hear Clifford. Oh, he's speaking so loud. Melanie, the, the house I'm in is surround sound. Thanks for that. Apologies. <laughs> Uh-huh. <laughs> okay. 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 Clifford, I need you to do better. Oh my gosh, I wish I could show you how cute he is right now. I always say this and then I'm like, I'll have my phone next time and I'll take a picture and you'll see. But no. Clifford, do you think we're gonna get Melba? You know who Melba is? Probably not. Okay. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. We remember 135 was like the big one. That, oh, 138? I forget the year. Oh my god. Jacob, thank you. Here's a hug. Uh, much appreciated. It's... I'm... I'm just a sad little wiener. All I want is to be a wiener. Like the winning kind. But instead, I'm just the sad kind. Oh... Oh no. You need to do a Clifford photo of the day in every video? Oh my gosh, I should. <laughs> oh my goodness. I love Clifford. How did you decide his name? He was actually already named Clifford and he was named after the Caves and Cliffs channel. Which is, I mean, the Caves and Cliffs update of Minecraft. I don't know what I just, <laughs> I just read the word channel. Yeah, he's named after the Caves and Cliffs update, and he's just a cute little goober. I couldn't change his name when he had a Minecraft name. Like, that's- that's metal. Stop, I really thought that that was her. I don't know why, it was the color scheme, uh, but that's okay. It's okay. 
because 135 and 138 were the numbers to get to. And if not, 169. <laughs> that was the update they picked? I think that that was the update that was happening at the time when he was born. Oh, you're so cute. What the heck? You're so cute when you're not trying to turn off my PC and being the worst. Oh, yeah, no, he's he's a little he's a little gamer. Okay, ah, oh my god, my laptop almost just fell. Okay. 135! 135! It's gonna be it! It's gonna be Melba! You know, if we'd gotten Hornsby, we would have ended so long ago. But it's it's really good that we haven't found any of the other ones because it probably would make me very sad. <sighs> okay. I would villager hunt more, but Orville talks so much. I know. It's so obnoxious. Like, say less words, please. Why say many when few words do trick? Who is this? Who even is this? Gonzo! Gonzo! Gonzo, you're, you're gonna be Gonzo. Stop saying hobnobbing. I don't want to hear it, okay? I, 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 get your little koala friend, Melba, and bring her here. No, not a double Gonzo, dude. Frick. Frick, it's every single time we have a... I'm not even exaggerating. Every single time we have a milestone we're looking forward to, we're like, oh, 135, that's gonna be it. Oh, oh, 69. It's always a koala. It is always a koala, but it's never Melba. I can't, I can't. Gonzo needs to be Gonzo. That's what I'm saying. He's gonna be if he shows up again, I swear. But that just means 138 is the one. Oh my gosh. I thought this would be over by now. Keep chugging, Charlie. Oh, trust me, me too. I also thought that, but here I am. It's okay, though. What will you give me if I show up on 138? Unconditional love and free housing, and I'll literally build your whole house for you, and it'll be beautiful, and you'll have your own Airbnb, and you'll love it. Is that not enough? <laughs> Oh my gosh, Clifford's so cute. I really wish I could show you. I feel like this is so... It's like, oh, this sunset's beautiful. Oh, I really wish I could show you. I feel bad for saying it, but he just is. Okay. Wait, let me get the bottle first, because I'm not really that concerned about getting a villager on this island. I pretty much just want the bottle is the reason that I... <laughs> it's, it's that Graham... No, I just, I just can't do it with the hamsters. Okay, though. We have two more until 138, and then bada bing bada boom, it'll be there. Oh. I have this, like, bottle of sparkling grape juice in my fridge that's been there for, like, a month, two months, maybe. And for some reason, I'm craving that now. That's my craving, is I just want, like, a little cup of my sparkling grape juice. That's what I can have if I successfully find Melba. Except it's really hard because I don't, I can't, like, my chair, the way that it is in my desk, it's right next to my bed. So I literally don't- I can't get out of my chair. Like, I need to climb on- like, over the desk. Like a little monkey or something to get out of this little setup I have. So if I had to go get that, it would be a whole affair, but I might just do it. Okay. Please. Melba, 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 I'm going to cry. I, 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 oh. Yeah. <laughs> Charlie, why do you do this to yourself? 
because I, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't think it would last this long. I thought it would be over. It's 138. It's the next one, baby. Here's the thing is I've never had one go this long. Like every time I have a villager hunt, people are like, oh, hope it doesn't take a thousand tickets. Somebody was looking for this person and it took them 2000 tickets. Now I'm like, no, 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 not the last villager, not on the last villager. Don't do this to me. We had, we were going so strong. You can do it. Believe in the power of Vegemite. You're right. I believe. I believe. I believe in the Vegemite. I've never seen it, but I, I'm sure it's real. I believe. Melba, 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 please. Oh. Okay. Do, 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 do. Let's go, girls. Okay. Melba. Melba. Okay, this is 138. I'm really scared, everybody. I'm really scared. Wait. What if... I know this is going to be controversial. What if I change to the Lucky Grub outfit right before? Okay. And now I'm a grub. And now I go... Melba, 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 Melba. Melba, 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 Melba. And then... Wait. Wait. Oh, where's the sneeze? Wait. I oh. Okay. <laughs> it's okay. Here's the thing, too, is I actually might have miscounted, so 138 might be in, like, one or two islands. You know what I'm saying? Like, I actually think... Melville looks weird. I know, it's so weird. No, I actually think... And I'm not saying this because I've lost my mind. I'm not even... I'm not even kidding. I think I accidentally added two to the counter. So... Actually, it's gonna be happening technically when it says 140. Does that make sense? Because I actually think it's true. I'm not making it up. I know that sounds like a lie. I know that sounds like a lie. I'm literally not making it up, okay? I'm not making it up because that was a bad villager. It's true. Okay. It's gonna happen. Gonna happen. Da da dee da da ba. Ding ding do 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 boom. Give me Melba. It does, in fact, sound like a lie. I swear! I swear it's the truth! Okay. 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 We're gonna be okay. I had that tiger on my first island, and I did not like her very much, I tell you that. <laughs> Y'all, I'm starting to think this Melba in chat is a phony. Starting to think this melt is not real. Starting to think they're lying. <laughs> Did Melba say something? Okay, Charlie, here's the deal. If you give my plot 200,000 bells, I'll come within the next two tickets. Okay, I can, I can do that for you. Okay, okay. I can do that for you. That is an easy ask. Okay. Okay. That's good. Oops. Oh, crud. Oh my god, I just stomped all over my hybrids. That was not good. Okay. Okay, drop. Drop. Oh, crud. Oh, wait. Okay, drop. I'll give you an extra thousand. How about that? How does that sound? I'll sweeten the deal. Stir the- sweeten the pot. I don't- what's that saying? I don't know. Okay. Charlie, you're wasting precious Melba looking time. I'm just giving a bribe. I'm just giving a bribe. It's gonna be okay. We're gonna find Melba today. 
Yay! <laughs> Sorry. My bad. I feel like the reason that the streams become more unhinged is that suddenly I like get into a mode of like forgetting that I'm streaming to people and it's just like I'm sitting and recording by myself because it's been so long. And like I just forget that there's people here. <laughs> Like, this is this kind of stuff that I would do when I'm sitting by myself and then I just cut it out later and I'm like, I don't even know what that was. Sorry. Sorry to me, myself and I, for exposing me, myself and I to that. Leopold. Nope. I forget who that is. Okay. Look. It's not funny anymore. It's, it's, oops, oops, oops. Okay, let's let's get Melba. Do 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 do. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. Dress as a koala. I've tried that and it didn't work. And also, I don't really have like a koala outfit. They don't really provide that the materials for that. Okay. But it's okay, you know? Melba's really good at hide and seek. I know. Yeah, I know. I'm, 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 I'm a little tired of this game. I would like to play something else. <laughs> I think it's gonna happen, though. I know I've said it before a million times, but I do think... It's gonna happen. That is a dog! Not what I want. Also, what are the words that Wilbur even says? Does anybody ever pay attention to those? Because I feel like sometimes I like zone out. And then I zone back in. And then I'm like, what are you saying? Blah, 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 brag, brag, what? It's so confusing. Why don't you just say normal words? He's like bell bottom apple squashers. We made it to this to the city, little slicker. It's like okay. Oops. You could have just said we've arrived, and then I wouldn't have to click through a bajillion lines of dialogue, but alright. Go off. La 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 ho. I know, and the, are you sure? Are you sure? Do you have all your tools? Okay, so where do you want to go? Are you sure about that? It's like, I'm, I'm gonna lose it if you don't get me there right now, Orville, I swear. Run it down! Okay. Remember, it's Island 152. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, no, that's probably why it wasn't working. It's because I forgot that. But now I remember it, so we're good. Neon monkey! Neon monkey! Get out of my life! Okay, okay, okay. Have you done Cappy today? It might be a refresher. What does that mean? All I can think of is Mario Odyssey. What is Cappy? Have I done Cappy? Like a Cap'n tour? Okay. Sorry, I just zoned out for like a minute there, but I'm good. I call him Cappy. Oh, Cap'n. Oh, that's kind of cute. It's gonna be okay, though. I'm gonna hydrate really fast. Okay, I've hydrated. 
hydration hydration koalas don't hydrate so that is why i hydrated grape juice of the sparkling variety no i haven't gone and gotten it yet it's too far it's too far i would only do that if we got what's her face melba to celebrate you know it's gonna be good i'm getting sleepy oh my gosh me too no way twinsies <laughs> It's gonna be good. I'm gonna find Melba and I'm gonna be so happy and then I'm gonna die. <gasps> it's been so long. What is a Melba anymore? I honestly agree. Oh my god. I honestly agree. I just been thinking that. I'm like, what are we even finding? What is this? Where am I? I don't know. This is driving me up a wall. How many tickets do you have left? Theoretically, about 25. <laughs> math. Math, math, math. Mathematical. That's what I'm going to say when I find Melba. You're a joke. You're a joke. You're a big blue joke. Are you freaking kidding me? You couldn't just be somebody else? Oh my god. Sorry, that was really aggressive. I'm just like... Oh. What the frick? What the nut? Okay, that's a koala though. We're on our way. We are on our way. Uh, you just gotta hold out hope, honestly. Thought that was Melba for a second. Me too. Me too. Swear I'm gonna lose my mind. Oh, me too. Have a snack? Oh my gosh, I bought so many snacks today for my flight. And I'm really excited to eat them. One of them is, um... Pretzels with no salt. Which I didn't know existed. And I'm a little skeptical of because I really like the salt on pretzels. But it's like just way healthier to not have that much sodium, which you know makes sense so i'm gonna try them and i'm gonna see how it is i was gonna make my own trail mix and do like uh what you call it i was gonna do like dehydrated marshmallows and pretzels and like checks or something and try and like i don't know do some sort of like funky little trail mix but then the dehydrated marshmallows had too much sugar and i was like mm, that's not the point of trail mix so instead I just got trail mix that was already made. All my creative juices were squashed like a bug. How did I get through here and I can't get back? And Melanie, thank you so much for being a member for two months. Using all of my Mel powers to send you all of the Mel vibes humanly possible. I appreciate it. I, I do appreciate it. All the Mel's in the chat. Thanks for being you. And for being a Mel. And because of you, we will find Melba. Ew. I thought it sounded good. I felt like I saw, I only saw it because people make like reindeer food or whatever. And it's like checks that are like frosted. And then they have pretzels and they have little chocolate chips and stuff. And it's like called reindeer food because it's cute and Christmassy. But... I don't know. Maybe it was misguided. That's why I didn't do it. It's because I didn't think through it enough and I knew. Yeah, but that's okay. If this stream goes on for five hours, I'm going to change my name to Melba. I just might too. The channel is no longer Charlie Barley. It is just Melba. Melba Schmelba. I feel like it would have been good. Oh, I saw somebody say ew and I got self-conscious about it, so I backpedaled. <laughs> oh my god, why did I think that was Melba for like a hot minute? Okay, that's okay. Bell bottom power pop. This is bing bing bong punt pontoons flash sore and lily going back home. Yes, please, Wilbur. <laughs> yes, please. <laughs> I think it was ew for the mouse. Oh, Oh, okay, my bad. I should have more confidence in myself and my abilities and my ideas. You're right. That was a lovely, delicious trail mix idea. 
I also the other day made um like I got a bunch of bananas and I got a uh, chocolate chips and I melted the chocolate and I put the bananas in it and I made banana chocolate and it was really good it was oh fart no 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 anyway yeah it was really good I think I would do it again I think I froze a bunch of bananas in the freezer but then I went on my road trip for like five days and forgot about them so hopefully they're good in there you know I would like to put more chocolate on them Blah 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 blah. I've been here for five hours. You know what, Brittany? I appreciate that. Thank you for sticking it out. Did any of your friends have me on their islands? Because if so, I might be in the moving queue. I don't have friends. <laughs> I don't know. Do you think I have friends that I play Animal Crossing with? No, no. It's just me, myself, and I, and not Melba. I don't understand this whole move and queue business. Why can't Nintendo just like just stop? You know? Blah 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 blah. Yeah. You should try making monkey munch. What is monkey munch? I don't know. I too have been here since the stream started. I appreciate that. Thank you for sticking it out with me, everybody. I appreciate you. I really do. You guys are the best. It's true. I want nuts now. I could use a nut. I don't know what monkey munch is. Ooh, but monkey bread? Oh my god. I could, I could crave some monkey bread right now. Every time I go to Walmart... I walk past this like frozen monkey bread and it's just like this pull apart monkey bread thing and it's like cinnamon sugar mm -mm, good and i just you know if i get melba tonight i just might buy that for myself tomorrow to compensate me for all my struggles because it just looks scrummy as frick every time actually i've made my own monkey bread before and it was not only very fun Stop! Stop it! No! You did not! I literally thought she was gonna be like, well, 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 if it ain't Charlie. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, 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 no. That's okay. That's okay. Hey. And Melanie, thank you so much. I have to go in a minute. If you're still streaming when I get home, I'm flying to Australia and getting her for you myself. I appreciate it. I would I would love that. Honestly though, flights to Australia are like freaking 40 hours long, so it would probably take you longer to get there and back. <laughs> but I appreciate it. We got debated. I literally I knew it. I knew it. I saw her stupid, stupid little head and her stupid little necklace and I knew. I've seen that little head too too many times on my island. And now I think we're actually nearing the point where we've gotten every single other koala except Melba. So I'm going to look you in the eyes, Orville. I'm going to look you in the eyes with my eyes. You hear me. Open your eyes. Look me in my eyes. If you don't give me Melba, I am going to lose my mind and I will delete this world. I will delete this world. Quinoa will be no more. You will be unemployed. And that is not an empty threat. Still waiting for 152? Me too. Me too. You should wish for Al and then you will get her. Um... Well, last time I did that, I like literally did get L, and I now I'm scared. Now I'm scared of the reverse psychology. <laughs> oh no, no, no! The reason you can't hold an axe in buildings—it's just to bleh. It's just to protect Orville, and they know it. It's gonna be great when I find Melba. How many tickets do you have left? I will check. That's a great question. That's a 
that's a great little little quizzy question. Let me check. Oh no 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 no! We have nineteen tickets. Look at us and our nineteen tickets! Yay! Oh, I didn't change the thing. I like don't even. I just this timer or this counter like. I think I've been doing it right, but then sometimes I'm like, did I miss one? I don't know. I'm going to do it. So I don't know. It's kind of like an estimate because a lot of the time people come in and they're like, how many islands have you done? And I'm like, I don't freaking, I don't know. I think I count that, but now I'm going to count it because I'm so good. Nintendo probably thinks Melba will make your island too OP with the best villagers and amazing theme. Oh, you're so right. You're so right. Oh my god. But... Nintendo is in for a, a, a little shocker because I'm about to find her, so... You know... It's no thing but a chicken wing. Okay, okay. That is so rude. I'm just really upset because every time I find a koala, it's not Melba. It, it takes a year and a half off of my lifespan. And that's not an exaggeration. Oops, sorry, I forgot to press the button. I was just kind of like sitting here, <laughs> zoning out. My bad. There's 488 villagers in Animal Crossing. Oh boy. Yeah. You know, 488, 400 and mate. I don't, it doesn't even mean anything because we're going to get Melba. It's also like, I have gotten every single other dreamy I've wanted within three hours. Why is it my final villager? Like, why did you have to do this on my quinoa? Not on my sacred quinoa. On the grounds of my quinoa. You're doing this to me. This was supposed to be a celebration. It was supposed to be like, you guys choose the villager and then I'll find it and then hee hee, I'll go do some other work and then I'll make food. But no, this isn't a game anymore. I am gonna literally boots who invited you I, I demand to know I demand to know who gave you an invitation and why did it get redirected from Melba's uh, address I don't understand okay I got my cat Shmishmu her name's actually Gizmo but I prefer Shmishmu with me for your good luck that is such a cute name I appreciate it thank you Shmishmu for your good vibes Charlie, it's the next island. My blessings work. All my power into 152. All right. 152. Please. Please, please. Please, 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 please. Nintendo, 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 Nintendo. You don't have to give me a plus. You don't have to give me a pleasy sword. You don't have to give me a fish, villager. Just give me Melba. La da 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 do de de do do da da Okay. Melba is so common on my villager hunts. I wish I could send her to you. Me too. Me, me too. But it's okay. Because the suffering is part of the... The fun. Because then you're like, oh my god, it's over. I did it. Cookie, if you show your face ever again, I will eat all of the cookies and you will be obsolete. Also, I don't think that was actually Island 152, so don't be alarmed. I think that we actually have that in two islands. So don't be alarmed. Don't be alarmed. I, I'm not even kidding. I actually added two extra. That's just Melba in a costume. She's cosplaying. Maybe that's why we've seen Cookie three freaking times. Melba's like, hee hee. 
but no. It's okay. We have 152 is in two islands, I think. Have you ever gotten Melba on a different villager hunt? I was trying to remember, and I don't remember. I'm going nuts, 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 bonker nuts in a nut bag. I need to, like... I only have so many tickets left. I mean, we, we're only in it for 20 more islands, and if I don't get Melba, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Okay, what color is Melba? Melba is a coffee-colored koala with white ears. Let me just show you, actually. Stop! Not again! Diana! Diana! Let me be the one to set fire inside. Don't lie. You may know me. You betty bedoli. Diana! This is a cry for help. Okay. I don't even- I'm not even- I don't know why I'm counting anymore. I don't know why I'm counting him anymore. Oh my god. I'll give you Nook Vile tickets. I'll probably just steal them from a treasure island. I can't- I cannot go past 169. I've made a vow. So... We'll just have to see. One Direction Slay. I know. That's all I think of when I think of the name Diana. It's gonna be good though. Do do do. Okay. La, 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 la. Here we go. 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 It's time for Melba. Oh, let's go. It's time for her because she's a little uh, koala. Forgot that word for a minute. I'm sad. Here we go. I'm your dad. <laughs> okay. Melba, Melba. It is time for you to come out of hiding. I am tired. Who is that? Certainly not Melba, I tell you that. Oh my god, Tipper! I told you, I don't want to see your little face anymore. This is breaking me. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Now, Melba! We're gonna do it. Don't you even worry. 155. Okay. It's gonna be fine. Ba 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 da ba ba da scooby ba da ba wee dee doo scooby dee bow. You know what I find so impressive is scatting. How do people scat? Like, what the heck? <laughs> Every for some reason scatting was like a mandatory part of my chorus class for like a substantial amount of my choir education and every time you bring me to the front of the classroom to scat over like freaking nothing i'd be like scooby-doo scoo scooby-doo do dooby scooby <laughs> like i just what is scatting who invented scatting like who went up on stage and was like zibity bat doo dee scooby that do it like what the f what the frick is that? What the frink? I don't understand. Oh, it's you, Olivia. Olivia. I actually like Olivia. Not enough, though. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> Cute, but not. <laughs> I agree. Cute, but not. Okay, okay. 156. I don't even know if this is accurate, but I'm gonna keep trucking. Blah da 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 I didn't have mo the money to go see 1D when they were in their prime, or even when they were in their non-prime, when they just had four members, so... Sad. If they ever do a re... 
not a relapse concert what's it called like a re re get together concert which i don't think they would ever do i would definitely go but my friend is like obsessed with harry styles we were like one direction stands together we saw the like this is us movie in theaters together and she's literally reunion yes that's the word <laughs> but yeah she's seen harry styles like five times in concert and i'm not even kidding you and it it, it rattles me i'm like oh my gosh it's so funny oh scorpion oi oh good day mate oh okay um some waters Got it. Oh my god. I'm gonna sting Cephalobot with this thing so he never appears again. Whoa, that was nutty. Did you see that? The way I snagged that scorpion like skilly papito. That was crazy, dude. Name it Melba's prize. True. I am going to sting Melba if she does not appear. And I know you're probably wondering, how will you do that if you're not in her vicinity? And the answer to that is simply magic. And a lot of hard work and determination. <laughs> oh my god. Why is this happening to me? God, of course, like, every other time when I'm doing a villager hunt and I, like, can afford to spend days going on villager hunts, I get it within three hours, and then the one villager hunt, the last villager hunt, it's just not gonna happen. Like, what the heck? The frick? <laughs> Who, like, signed off on that scheduling? Okie dokie. Okie dokie. Okie dokie, okie dokie, okie dokie. Was able to eat dinner, beat Tears of the Kingdom, and edit a video all in this stream. Well, you know what? I'm proud of you. I wish that was me. So bad. Okay. If I see another bird, I'm going to sting it. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. How can say where the road goes? Only time. Is it just me or is the color of the Dodo Airlines different now? Is that just me? I feel like that's just me. It feels different. It feels like a different shade. Maybe that's like... I don't know. I don't... I don't... I don't know. Mac and cheese music? What the heck? What does that mean? Oh, mac and cheese. I could go for some mac and cheese. I was supposed to have mac and cheese tonight. Oh no, and I didn't make it. All I wanted was mac and cheese. <laughs> I totally forgot. I was supposed to make mac and cheese. Now I'm never gonna have it. It's only- it's 10. Oh, did your monitor adjust to nighttime color mode? No, I think my eyes are just breaking. Who can say where the road goes? Only time. Oh, ho, 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 ho. oh my god. This is a nightmare. Stove stoves. That I can't even read. I'm done. Okay, 159. We'll have to check how many tickets we have left when we get back. I will cry if we don't get stupid Melba. What if Melba is in the move-in queue? I don't... I don't know. I don't know how that works. I don't know how the move-in queue works. How do I know? Oh my god! Melba, please come so I can sleep. We're gonna get her, so it's fine. It's just whatever. It's just so you know. It'll be fine. My bedtime was an hour ago. Me too. Oh, me too. 
It's okay. It's okay. It's never too late to eat mac and cheese. You're really- you're right on with that, I feel. Okay. Melba. Melba. I don't even want you that bad. I okay. We literally have nine tickets left. That's that's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. Nine whole tickets? That's all we have? Oh my god. It's okay, we're gonna get her. It's fine, it's fine. Everybody cross your fingers. Cross your little little toes. It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. Oh. <laughs> According to this website, you can still find Melba even if she's in the move-in queue? Is this real life? I hope so. All I want in this life is to find- Like, literally, this was just- is supposed to be easy. It was supposed to be the final, final villager, and I was supposed to get it, and it was gonna be like, woohoo, and then it was gonna be great. So why is it feeling so hard? Watching the stream has turned my retinas into Melba's. My brain is a Melba, I'm not gonna lie to you. Okay. Don't stop the search. I only have a limited amount of tickets, so... Oh my god, I've never seen this bunny before. What the heck are you? Francine? What? I've never seen that bunny. Oh, that's fake. 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 Where's Melba? Okay. Okay. I am like, I don't want to stop the stream, but I also am like... I don't know. I need to get more tickets from a treasure island anyway. And... I don't know. Anyway, good- yeah, good thoughts, good thoughts. I'm not- I'm not giving up. I'm not a quitter. I'm not a quitter. It doesn't matter because we're gonna get Melba before anyway, so I don't even need more tickets because we're gonna get her, so it's totally fine. Check thy tickets. I have eight. No! Don't! Stop! Stop, Orville. Stop. Stop. Okay. What can I do you for? You think you're so quirky saying that, don't you, Orville? Well, I've heard it literally 161 times today. I don't want to hear it again. Actually, more times because I went to Harv's Island earlier. So stop it with that, please. Okay. What's the plan after you run out of tickets? plan is step one um i don't i don't know <laughs> step one end the stream and change the title so that nobody says um actually you you ended the stream but you did not find melba <sighs> step two wash my face because i feel like i need to wash my face step three make mac and cheese maybe i'm not really sure I'm not really sure yet. I'm not quite sure. Step four. Um, make a stream thumbnail for tomorrow. Step five. Wake up and repeat, baby. Grind never ends. What was the question? I literally don't know. <laughs> An action frog. Can I please give you my Nookwile tickets? They're free. I don't know. I mean, I, I can just get them from a treasure island and it'll just be easy peasy schmeepsy schmoopsel. I'm also going to stop playing Animal Crossing for... The foreseeable future until tomorrow. <laughs> I need a, a brain break. But we'll see. I might not even need it because I'm gonna see Melba in like five seconds. So why would I need your your tickets if I'm gonna get Melba right now? You know. Bra -ba -ba -da 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 -da. 
How do you do treasure islands? I tried it once and got so worried it would break my switch. I like don't even know. I'm really bad at it. I just kind of go and then I s spam until I get allowed on. Oh. And then I get the tickets and then I run away very fast because I'm scared and I feel like Nintendo's going to kill me. And that's pretty much my strategy. I don't really know how they work. I just kind of try my best. I'm not very good at all of the Animal Crossing stuff. Like Nook is on? I've never used Nook is on. Why you hit Daisy? She's precious. Sorry. <laughs> I just was upset for a minute. Oh. Okay. Welcome to your one and only gateway to the skies. I bet I could recite Orville. Actually, probably I couldn't because I don't read it, but I could try. So you want to use your Nook Miles? Like it's Roger. Do you have all your tools? Yep. All right, let's get you airborne. Click, 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 click. You're not even touching the keyboards. You're such a fool. Okay, okay, it's this one. Sylvia, I believe you for some reason. Okay. Look at Melba. <laughs> what is Melba? I've never heard of that. Melba, Melba, Melba. It's a fake word now. Okay, 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 okay. I'm nervous. Wee woo, wee woo, wee woo, wee woo. Wee woo, wee Wee woo, wee woo, wee woo, wee woo. That was upsetting. It's okay though. It's okay because bell bottom mambo stovetop leg warmer. We're gonna go to the next one and grind all day, baby. We're gonna find this dumb koala. It's a kept squirrel. He took the words straight from my mouth and put them into existence. I'm convinced they took her out of the game. I don't think she ever existed. I think she's fake. I literally don't. This this villager is literally not real. Oh, yum, yum, yum. <laughs> I don't, I don't, I don't think this is, I've, have I even seen her? Everybody says no, but I thought I did once. Maybe it was just a hazy ghost memory. Hey, okay. Mm -mm. The title doesn't say that's the only reason the stream will end. That's true. That's true. This is true. I'm just gonna say... My, you pick my, um, last villager. And then I'm gonna be like, really, we just took seven hours deliberating over who we should get. But the next stream is the villager hunt. I know, I'm sorry for the mix-up. Like, it's, it's understandable that you would be the confused. It's Goldie. It's Goldie. I, 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 why, why? <sighs> yeah, I don't know. I don't know anymore. I feel like every time I start talking, I lose my train of thought in the middle of my sentence. And then I'm like trying to remember while I'm talking. And then it just, it's a whole thing, you know? Stream ends when I find Melba or Clifford hits the power button. I can say, oh my god, you're so right. That's going to be my excuse. I'm going to be like, sorry, Clifford hit the power button. I'll stage it and everything. I'll be like, all right, guys, let's go to the next island. Oh, no, wait. And then <laughs> and then I'll click the power button. No, and then I'll click the stop button. And then next time I'll be like, guys, sorry, Clifford hit, hit the power button. And, and like my whole PC broke. And then like I needed to get it repaired, but we're back now. So the stream technically hasn't ended. You know? I fell asleep and paused multiple times and you're still going. I think I fell asleep multiple times in this in this stream too. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, Eucalyptus Island, give me something good. Oh my god, why did I think that was her? Why did I think that you were a monkey? 
Koala. Good lord. I don't know why. Oh god. And Grace Finn, thank you so much! And here since the beginning, this is for your therapy after this stream. Thank you. I appreciate it. I know. This is... This is... I apologize. We're gonna get there. We're gonna do it. It's gonna be fantastic. And we're gonna be like, aren't we so glad that we sat here for like seven hours? And it's gonna be good. It's gonna be great. Yeah. Woohoo. I had like plans. I had mac and cheesy plans. I was like eight o'clock stream ends. Then I make food. Who did that? Was that me really? Me in the past? What an idiot. What a what a stupid little idiot. I can't believe this about me. Sometimes I hear these facts about me and I just simply am bef befazzled. I'm like, no, that can that's not me. But it is. Oh my god. Should have chosen Poncho? I haven't found Poncho either. What do you mean I should have chosen Poncho? <laughs> I should have chosen Horn be a horn horn guy. I should have would have been done like 10 years ago oh my god <laughs> just, for some reason that's so oops i meant to hit you with the net i didn't mean to talk to you sorry for some reason that's so funny to me right now is should have chosen poncho i haven't even seen poncho <laughs> oh my god that's so good that's that's a real kicker dude okay why do they always have to verify? It's like, I'd like to leave. Are you sure you like to leave? Yes. Oh, but what? Don't make sure you don't leave anything behind. Yeah, please let me leave. No, nope, but did you did you cut the trees? Do you don't wasps? You can't bring them. Okay, yes. And then finally you leave. Like, what the heck? I wanna fly. How many tickets do I have left? Shoot, I'll check when I get there. Fly! You must put on a poncho. I'm not looking for poncho. I know, 169 is our only hope. I'm- I'm scared. I'm scared more than anything in the world. And you know what I'm gonna do to truck through it is think about- think about the bubble tea at the end of the rainbow. I didn't even wear my blue light reflecting glasses so my eyes are like rebelling. They're like throbbing right now. I'm gonna get bubble tea. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get mac and cheese. Mac and cheese. Okay, okay, shush, hush now. Okay. We have one ticket. Okay. Tipper, I swear to God. Literally, why? Nobody wants you here. Oh my God, Tipper, what the frick? What the frink? I'm so sick of it. Charlie, you sound broken. I am broken. Tipper for the fifth time. Go away. Get out of my life. We need to get one more ticket for 169. I know. I'm such a broken soul. I'm a broken little grub in a world that's trying to hurt me. Okay, okay. Let me, let me go. Oh, la, 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 la. I don't even know who we're searching for anymore. Maple? Mul Mulbilly? Mul Melba? Melba. I don't even know. Okay. Let's see. I'm gonna do... This is gonna be a little surprise for you and for me. We're gonna put Melba at the top of the screen. And then we'll see. And then it'll be so shocking when we see who it is. <laughs> oh my god! Okay. 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 Oh, this is so hard. What island layout is this even? Hello? Oh. Oh, it's one of these. Hello? <laughs> oh my god, what the heck is that thing? 
That did not work as I wanted it to. I was really excited, but no, that was bad. What the frick? I've never seen that little guy before. Okay. Let us get our 169th ticket. We're at 168, maybe? I, like, don't remember. I don't even know. I think I counted them before. I might not even be at 168. OMG. It's Marble. <laughs> What's her name? Melba. Oh my god, I keep forgetting. It's marble. I, I'm so happy. Okay. Let us get our ticket. Melba looks a little different. Yeah, I don't know what really happened. Um, Don't know what happened to sweet dear old Melba. Wow. It's the dark time on this island. Oh my god. Sorry, Doc. <laughs> okay. Belma better show up. I'm hoping. Oh, God. Okay. All right. Okay. One Nook Mile ticket. Doc has fleas? Oh, my God. No way. Is Does he actually? I'll get him. I'll get him. I'll get him. Let me at him. I actually need to do that for a sticker. There's free treasure islands on Twitch. That's usually what I do. But I right now, I just don't feel like going to one. Okay. Do you have fleas? Oh my god, he does! How did you see that? Your eyes are like another level. Oh my god. I got a flea. Whoa. Did I just get a sticker live on stream? I literally did. I got the last flea flicker sticker. No way. I need to write that down so I don't forget to include it in the video. What the heck? Wow. That was like history in the making that you all just witnessed. I hope you know. Home from babysitting, the dad asked me what I was watching, and instead of live stream a video game, he looked at me and said, Why is an Emmy? Oh my god, because I oh my god. <laughs> I I feel judged. I don't know. We're all just suffering together. Okay. I am begging. The flea is a sign. The flea is lucky. The flea is a lucky little flea. A lucky, lucky little flea. The curse is lifted. The Melba curse. And now we're going to get Melba. The flea is Melba. Wait a minute. <laughs> get Melba's head up there. Okay. Oh. My bad. Eh. Okay. Actually, I probably should have visibility. <laughs> Okay. Please, 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 please. Okay. I am... Let me just... I am... I am but a, a, but a woman. All I want... I know that that's not Melba. I was about to do a whole speech. the power to end oh my god end the stream i'll come tomorrow this is this is devastating this is devastating okay i'm so sad i'm so sad i'm so sad i'm so sad I'm so sad. 
<laughs> why? 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 Oh my god. Okay. Dang. Darn, darn, darny, darn. That's all I have to say about that nonsense. Okay. Well, oops, oops, oops. Here. We have failed. Just today. Tomorrow, we will come back. What is wizard? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for the celebration. But tomorrow, tomorrow was the day. Look at me. I am but a human. And tomorrow, we will find Melba. I swear it. I swear it for sure. I'm gonna make my mac and cheese. Um, and then it's gonna be, you know, in me. I don't know. I don't have brain power anymore. So yeah, that's that. Um, thanks for hanging out with me and thank you for all your support. I hope you'll come tomorrow and suffer with me more. But if you don't want to, I entirely understand. <laughs> but... Anyway, oh my god, Clifford, stop! 